All right, well, so the plan tonight is to finish the run. Um, I should have all the money I need. I should have all the, the, the money should not be a problem. Hopefully, hopefully my calculations are correct. There's just a few things on my list here that I need to really need to do, um, or that I kind of want to do, um, just to break things up a little bit. But um, other than that, the only things I really have to do in over the next two weeks in game is make sure I talk to Maru every day so I don't lose friendship with Maru, lose hearts with Maru, lose friendship with my wife, and um, just check kegs. That's it. That's all we're doing. So let's jump in. So on the third, I've already forgotten what day it was. On the 13th, we're going to take Willie Alinkod. It's the 12th. So tomorrow we're going to get the quest for that. Um, we have one more quest on the 15th. We are going to do Starfruit on Ginger Island on the 14th. We need to. Um, we'll get a pearl from the night market on the 15th. And on the 19th, we'll take Gus a Coconut. And that is it. So that being the case, a lot of the stuff can get sold. Now where's Maru? And what's the, do I care about luck anymore? Oh, recipes. I also need to make sure I get recipes. Do not want to screw that up. Uh, you know what I'm going to do, actually? Before I do anything else, uh, I'm just going to do the following. Because I don't want to get to this point and be, like, ripping through stuff and screw everything up. So I'm just going to grab a copy of my cowbell folder. I'm going to copy that. I'm just going to save a copy of it. I'm going to save scum, basically. Uh, just to be safe. I do not want to screw this up. All right. So, basically, yeah, let's find Maru. Make sure we talk to her. There she is. Hello, Maru. Thank you for feeding the animals, even though I don't have any animals left. Except for Bingo. Okay, so that's taken care of. I forgot to grab starfruit. I should probably just keep some starfruit on me at this point, actually. Uh, let's just grab all of it. Um, and then, no idea when... Um, part of me still wants to make more kegs. I mean, I guess I could just make whatever kegs I can. And that's not going to kill me. That's the wrong tree. There we go. Um, could you make whatever kegs? If they're... I'm just going to leave that one. I'll wait till they still will sink up down there. If some kegs make themselves available, then they all buy some kegs. Or make some kegs. Uh, in the meantime... Yeah, there's no longer any rush. If my calculations are correct. If they're not, then this won't be the last... Uh, <laughs> I'm going to re-grab that save, and this won't be the last uh, the last day I play Stardew. Well, that won't be the last day of this challenge. <laughs> I'm so not used to... Uh, sleeping days. That's okay. We're, we're going to get through this. So I'm just going to check the, um, it would be really nice if I had the, uh, return totem. Because I could just go here, grab a screenshot. I, cause I, have, I didn't mark down when my kegs are going to be done, I have no idea. Um, the kegs are not ready. So I'm just going to go up to the mine. I guess I could, may as well bring the triple shot. Oh, I should have put some in the... Whoops. Forgot to actually get the triple shot going. Uh, any... I got some iron. May as well make what I can, because uh, it's all money now. The sooner I get 10 million, the better, quite frankly. Ooh, I don't have any coal. Huh. That's unfortunate. Okay, I'm just going to leave all my ore here. Uh, maybe I will, maybe, I, let me go back to the house first, get the coffee going, and then I will go to the train station. Again, I'll just see if there's any oak resin there, just because I can, because um, I can sell it. And, uh, whoops, forgot to put the coffee in. I need to decide if I want to, um... I need to decide what I want to do for Ginger Island. If I want to stay there ahead of time. Like, if I want to spend the night before on Ginger Island. Or if I want to... Uh... Oh, we got silver quality. Okay, in the cast. Do I want to spend... Hmm. 
more time on Ginger Island. Fisher jumping. Um, you know what I think I might do? I might just use these kegs temporarily. Just to get a bit more coffee done. Okay, so we've done that. I literally, <laughs> literally only need one more keg. Um, you know what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I want ten more kegs. Let's go see Clint. For the last time, I'm not going to buy any more. I'm just going to buy... Uh, I don't think I, I think I only have like two pieces of copper ore at the mine or something. Let's go check. We'll buy whatever we need to make ten more kegs, and that'll be it. Just for funsies. I've got two. I need twenty. No, I need fifty to make ten kegs. So I need forty-eight, and then ten coal. Okay, forty-eight copper ore, ten coal. Got it. Take the garbage can on the way by. It's Friday, he's not here. All right, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go into the mines. I guess I am doing more than I thought today. Uh, let's go find some coal, I guess. See if I get lucky. Got my animation canceling. All right. One day. I was thinking one day I'll remember, but this might be the last day of the challenge, so. Ooh, I got a piece of coal there, nice. If I find a ladder, I'll take the ladder. Quick check. See another ladder. There's another ladder. Even better. How much do I have? 13. We're actually doing pretty well. I only have three um, coals, though. I need seven more coal. Hopefully it's a good luck day or something and I can just get lots. Anything here? There's one. Whoops, that was the wrong button. Okay, well, there's another couple of them. I'm not going to bother going to the other direction that I didn't go. Left. Oh, oh my word. Everything's everything's going wrong. 21. Need more than that. Of course, I did just put friggin' iridium in all the chests. So, I mean, I'm not going to be able to make 10 more today anyways, because... I think there might be like one, one or two, um... For furnaces, rather, that aren't being used right now. What I'm hoping is that I'll be, I'll get to 10 million, um, oh, nice. What I'm hoping is that I'll get to 10 million, um, oh, there's 50, sweet. I'm hoping I'll get to 10 million, like, without having to just, you know, kind of go through and sell everything and deal with whatever. I'm kind of hoping I can get away with that. Um, because if I can do that, that'll be helpful. All right, let's go to level 40, and we do, we only probably need to find four pieces of coal. Should've, should've, should've brought a bomb with me, that would've been useful. Let's go kill this guy so we can get a ladder sooner. There we go. More copper. Coals. I need what two more coal or something? Was it seven? Yeah, I think I only need seven. Oh, I see some dust sprites. I see two dust sprites. Will I get one coal from each? Yes, there we go. Alright, let's get out of here. I'll just break these barrels because for all time's sake, can't help it. Alright. I don't even care about these guys. I'll let them live. Wood. Wood's a problem. Okay, while those are smelting, let's run over to the, uh... Whatchamacallit? Train, train, train. Train area. And we'll cut down all the trees that have the tappers on them. 
Oh, triple shot ran out. Because these guys are no longer needed. Why is my inventory full? Weird. Alright, let's get rid of the rusty spur. I'll call the trading card. Going in the business sale, everything must go. Yeah, you're not wrong. It's one of those things where I kind of feel like I'm not used to I'm, I'm, Whenever I'm playing casually, like I'm always playing for the next year, right? Like, let me get set up this year for next year. Let me get set up this year for next year. But now it's like, this is my first, like, real proper timed challenge. Um, so this is, yeah, this is very much like Everything must go. There we go. All right. More than enough wood now. Inventory is full, but whatever. We'll gloss over that. Just throw that out. Oh, I guess I could throw this out too. That would have been smart. All right. So back to the mine. Okay, yeah, <laughs> okay, so this day we're playing through most of it, um, the, f the following days we'll actually kind of run through a bit more quickly here. Old habits die hard. Alright, so... Oh, nice. Sweet, okay, we're good. Uh, I also have two coal left, so let's throw in two more iridium bars, why not? This stuff's getting sold. It's money in the bank, baby. There we go. Uh, might just... Uh, you know what I might do? Should I leave stuff here or should I take it back to the farm with me? Now that I'm not making any more... I'll leave it here for now. I might just take the stuff all back to the farm. That way if I do get any random ores or whatever, I can smelt them on the farm. But I'll just wait for these guys to finish and then we'll head back. We will make whatever kegs we can. Should be able to make three more kegs. Four more kegs, four more kegs. And uh, yeah, this is it, it's coming down to it. All right. Back to the farm. What up, Pam? Oh, one thing I was gonna try and do, maybe I'll do that today in game two. I know, I'll keep adding stuff. Uh, but maybe I will, oops. Maybe I will, there's one last cutscene we have not cut scene um so maybe i'll do that maybe i'll do that and we're still missing uh the, the abigail cut scene the abigail's eight hearts cut scene um haven't seen that and that's the only cut scene that's left that we even have it we're gonna have access to within the two years right every, every other cut scene has to wait for spring or not winter or whatever so we have one more cut scene I get all those? I think so. We got one more cutscene, and that is it. Ooh, a diamond. Yoink. Ah. Oh, I don't want to put that there. Oh, well, whatever. Okay. Let's make some more triple shot, just because, why not? Uh, I might... Should I, I wonder if I should start selling stuff. I feel like I should... Just start, like, do I need these iridium bars? Do I need the diamond? Don't need those. I'm gonna sell half my apricots. Uh, I guess I'm selling old resin now. Sell that. Bat wings, sap, crab, amethyst, bug meat, acorns, fiber. Yeah, let me just run through and see if there's stuff I can sell. That chest is empty. This chest. What do I even need right now? So, okay, so here's the thing. Uh, I, right here, the only thing, the only things that I actually need to have in game are these one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight things. I need two tomatoes, a coconut, a wild horseradish, one bread, one oil, one lingcod, one shrimp. That's it. Anything beyond that, I can sell. 
All those kegs up there are done. Good to know. Let's just do these guys right now. I'm actually kind of looking forward to the last week in game because um, the last week in game is going to be great. I'm not going to have to worry about kegs or anything. Uh, okay, so let me just check for. Let me check here. That's good. That's good. Check here. Just have pumpkins. I'm going to need some pumpkin. They're probably going to need like those two stacks. I probably won't need um, the gold star pumpkin. The truffle oil, I'm just going to sell. So I need two tomatoes. Got them. I need one lingcod, one shrimp. One lingcod, one shrimp. Uh, one coconut, one wild horseradish. Coconut, horseradish. One bread, one oil. There's the bread. There's the oil. So I was keeping the sugar and the ginger to make ginger ale. Oh, because I need three ginger. So let me grab those guys out. Um, I might just sell these. I don't know if there's anything else I can make with them, is there? Just sashimi. Deconstruct recycling machines for iron bar. Oh, good idea. <laughs> Fantastic idea. Uh, so there's nothing else I can make right now, so I may as well just sell this stuff. Uh, recyclers can definitely go. Good call, Rath Rathman. Rathman, what? Okay, uh, let's check these chests. So that one's empty. I'm actually just gonna knock these ones out. Okay, so this one here. I've got like... I'll keep like 10 iridium bars. 5 diamonds. Uh, getting rid of the fiber, bug meat, sap. Should I make something with these though? Probably... N is it worth it? I don't even know. What can I even make? I don't even know. Um, probably nothing worth making. Could make a mountain totem. <laughs> yeah, forget it. Okay, this chest here can go as well. Um, I'll keep like. Let's sell all the battery screw. Yeah, I don't know. I'll just. Uh, hmm. This is killing me. Bee house can go too. Should get syrup or iron bar, whichever. Oh, for sure. That's a good idea. A good call. Wow. Okay. Um, I'll keep like three batteries. Maybe like five gold bars. Five or five quartz. Got lots of stone. I might start selling stone as well. These torches can go. Okay. In here, all of these I was saving to put in the preserve jars. So I won't sell them just yet because... Oh, I've got like fertilizer and stuff I could sell too. Forgot about that. Okay, I have to sell a bunch of that. This stuff here, can't do much with any of this stuff. Uh, we've got some geodes I'll probably crack. The acorns can go. Um, I should probably go to the desert and clean up the desert too, actually. That's empty. And that one's just food, which I'll probably sell most of. All right, so let's start selling stuff here. Oof, this is hurting me on the inside. Let's sell another half of my apricots. Sap, uh, uh, don't don't sell the star fruit. That's a reset right there. 19 iridium bars. Sell the ginger. Hate to sell the sugar, but I'm gonna do it. Sell the hardwood. Pine tar, batteries, stone. Yeah. Um keep the wood for now. Sell the star fruit wine. Sell the gold bars. Okay. So, geodes can go in there. Oh, I'll sell the torches as well. Oh, I can't sell torches, can I? Oh, yes, I can. Okay, um... Wait, that chest is empty. Let's knock that chest out. And then food. Um... A lot of these things aren't super useful to me because... Like, when am I ever going to need foraging or defense? I kind of don't. Max energy magnetism? Not really. Fishing? No. Max energy farming? Farming. Farming. Have to think about that. Um, maybe I'll start eating crab cakes, actually. I could do, like, one crab cake per day. Um, magnetism can go. Dish of the sea can go. Escargot can go, 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 escargot. 
farming. Hey, does anybody know, it does farming, um, does farming make you like plant and harvest stuff faster? Because that would be useful information to have for tomorrow in game when I, when I, uh, have a bunch of farming to do, or I guess in two days. Let's finish this up here. So, no. Huh. So what does it do? It affects the quality of what you harvest. Oh. That's... Is that useful to me? Probably not, unless I had speed with it. If I could do it with speed, that would be fine. And maybe reduce energy of hoe and watering can, which I'm not even using. So if there was a farming that added speed, and none of them do. All right, forget it. Uh, it doesn't help for things you are going to keg. Exactly. Well, I was thinking, like, because eventually I'm going to end up with more star fruit than I have kegs to put them in. Pepper poppers. Oh, farming and speed. There we go. Yeah, so the idea is that if I end up with all gold quality star fruit, at some point I'm going to be selling some star fruit. Like, I'm just going to have more star fruit than I have kegs to put them in. So really... I might actually save that for the last day. Like my last harvest. Because my last harvest is going to be... Let's have a look. Uh, so my, my next harvest on the 14th. Crop planner. 14. Star fruit with deluxe speed grow. Plant. That finishes on the 23rd. So I'm actually going to write that down right now. Winter 23. GI. Let's just do this. Copy, paste. Okay. Hey, what's up, Yahoo boy? Uh, it's going pretty good. It's going pretty good. I'm getting getting ready to skip a bunch of days. Not quite there yet. Uh, so yeah, pepper poppers. Good call. We'll do that. Oh, I've got two. How long does that last? Now, there's a good question. Pepper poppers lasts seven minutes. I might save it. I might save it. I probably could use like use one now, use one later. I should do that anyways. Who cares? Like I'm, I shouldn't need the money anyways. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so we're gonna sell clear rugger, sell farmer's lunch, sell fish stew, fried eel. I've got so well, hmm, because the. Plus one luck. I may actually hang on to that. We'll see. Um, last thirty value stream for like, yes. I'm gonna finish. The I'm gonna finish it tonight. Hopefully. Uh, hopefully it all goes well. Super meal, survival burger, Tomka soup, trout soup. All right. And maybe since I have a bit of time, I do want to go and get that Abigail cutscene today as well. That's gonna be the last cutscene that we have access to. Um, really concentrating right now. <laughs> to make sure I don't screw this up. Vile burger, super meal, maple bar, mango sticky rice, red plate, stuffing, pepper pepper keeping, complete breakfast, miner's treat, pancakes, farmer's lunch, fish stew, fried mushroom. Okay, we're good. Um, yeah, I'm gonna start skipping days, but I wanna get Abigail's cutscene, but that doesn't, I can't get access to it for another 40 minutes in game. So what I'm gonna do instead is use my last uh, totem. And let's go to the desert. And let's see if we can clean out this desert chest. I don't think I'm going to be doing any more skull cover runs. I don't really think there's any point. Not that I wouldn't. I won't need to, anyways. Um, I'll leave a few things here just in case. But plus three luck. Wow. And I got three magic rock candy. Holy cow, I've got so much stuff here. Um, yeah, I guess I'll leave a few things here just in case. I can sell them at the very end if I need to. The minor treats can definitely go, though. Um, a little bit of food. Am I ever going to use... I'm never going to drink this ginger ale. It's just, just not going to happen. It might happen. It might happen. If I decide to do a skull cavern run... School. If I decide to do a Skull Cavern run, I won't need the speed, but if I can take the luck... I'm so bad at Skull Cavern runs. I don't know. 
I don't know. Um, 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 um. All right, this is fine. 7.30. Okay, I got a few minutes. Ooh, isn't this the cutscene where I have to... No, this is like the, the Ouija board cutscene. Not weirdo Abigail. Can't help it. I'm gonna cut down the street. Alright. Oh, triple shot ran out. Okay, let's go see Abigail. And, um... Then we'll sell a few things, and yeah, well, I'll basically do... Oh, I will do the same thing tomorrow. Tomorrow in game, I will, um... Yeah, do what I said I was gonna do. The, the thing I said I was gonna do, and didn't, that. So tomorrow in game, talk to Maru, check kegs, sleep. Then we get, the next day we go to Ginger Island. Blah, blah, blah. Hello? She ain't here. Right. Because I think that cutscene has to, is supposed to... I think the wiki says this cutscene triggers between 8 and 10 p.m. Enter their house between 8 and 10 p.m. when Abigail's home. When the heck is Abigail home? Where is she? Where's Abigail? Uh, winter. Winter 15. So it's Friday. Monday, Tuesday, Thursday. Goes to bed at... She goes to bed at 7.30? What day is it today? Today's Friday. Oh, she gets home at 9.40. Oh, okay. Well, we can still do this then. Um, I don't want to wait. We don't want to wait around for an hour, though. Have to keep an eye on the time, make sure I have time to get back. Let's just sell a few things, then we'll go and hang out and wait around for, for Abigail. Oh, yeah. I gotta grab these guys. May as well grab this as well. Okay, so let's sell the sap, coconut, cactus fruit, eight miners' treats. Uh, that cactus fruit, trout selling jades. I do want to check the, um, um, whatchamacallit, greenhouse, um, and just see what I can sell in there. There's, there's lots of stuff in that greenhouse chest I could probably sell. So I want to keep an eye out for that. Make sure my triple shot's going to last me. It is. Abigail should be here any moment. There she is. Do take your time. Oh, I was going to check that garbage can. Glad I didn't. There we go. Cutscene. Hey, I was hoping you'd show up at 9 o'clock at night. I want I want to show you something. See this? It's called a spirit board. Have you ever used one? Hard no. Hard no. Put your hands on the planchet with me. Let's planch this. Now the spirits will guide us toward a... Look, it's moving. It's probably me moving it. The first letter is I. Next is love. Wow, look at it go. It's spelling out P-A-P-A. -P -A. Oops, accidentally knocked over the board. <laughs> it's just a silly game. It doesn't mean anything. I, um, have something to do. You'll have to go, sorry. The funny thing, of course, being that I'm already married. Alright, there we go. That was the last cutscene. That was the last cutscene we're gonna watch. Crazy. It's hard to believe this has been, like, the 50... 50... 7th or 57th stream, I think, or 50. I think this is the 58th video on the tubes, or the 58th video, but um, I think I broke one stream into two videos for some reason. I think that might have been a thing that happened. Anyways, hey, a jade. Yoink. Oh, you know what I should do? Prime Stardew Valley cutscene. Um, here's a question. I look at jade. So Jade sells for 200 and Diamond sells for 750 Gold per day. Oh, Diamond's still... Not by much, but Diamond's still worth it. So maybe what I'll do while we're talking about it 
Let's throw a diamond in this crystal iron. Got an extra one here somewhere. There we go. Good thing I kept a few. Uh, let's throw a do diamond. In there. Alright. Um, this coffee can go in there. Uh, okay, so I, will, I guess I can't... Can I sell the chests or do I have to like deconstruct them into wood? Gotta deconstruct them. Alright. Uh, you know what? I've got time. Let me go check the greenhouse right now. Let's just see if there's stuff we can get rid of. What do we have? Wow, uh, a lot of stuff we can get rid of. Okay, so let's see here. Um, fertilizers can go. Retaining soils can go. Speed grow can go. Uh, the deluxe speed grow... I might leave that on Ginger Island, actually. Because I'm, I have hyper speed grow in here, I think. Either deluxe or hyper speed grow. It might be hyper speed grow. Um, so I don't really think I need to have this here. Uh, done with the artichokes, beans, melons, mixed seeds, pineapples, rhubarb, wheat, winter seeds. Great. All the stuff can go. This is good. This is good. Oh, I just heard, I was like, I just heard something finish. Inventory is full. Uh, all right, so let's sell uh, that one, 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 uh, that one, those three, not that one, <laughs> that one there. That was almost catastrophic. I mean, I should be fine, but I'm kind of keeping it just in case. Uh, okay, so that's good. Let's throw the next bee house in there. Sell the maple syrup. All right, let's go to bed. Tomorrow, we'll make tomorrow a quick day. Oh. What is that? That's ancient fruit wine? I keep telling myself, don't use these kegs. Save those kegs for coffee, but I can't help it now. Now it's, really not, now it's just all about the money. Okay. Let's go to bed. Um, I should have all of the uh, star fruit seeds I need on Ginger Island. There's another 200 quarter of a million. Very nice. May have just spilled too much water all over myself. Okay, so. Uh, kegs. Maru. There's Abigail. Hi, um, I just wanted to say sorry for acting so weird yesterday. You probably understand what happened. Uh, okay, bye. Yeah, I know what happened. I got up early and fed all the animals. Thanks, Maru. Alright. So this actually should be... Caroline. This should be Linkod. Yes. Willie wants a Linkod. Alright. It's all the parsnip. So, um... I guess just for the lulls... Uh, let's, let me grab the Linkod. Let's do this right now. Let's get this out of the way. Got one right here in the fridge. It's been there for months. Are there animals that could be sold still? Nope. <laughs> No, there are not. Oh, we do have some wine down there. Happy is from the fridge. <laughs> yeah. Willie will probably still compliment the quality. Okay. I did no, I did greenhouse yesterday, so we should be good. Myra was just feeding imaginary animals. Oh, I guess she, she watered the dog, though. She gave the dog some water, so I guess it all counts. Okay, um... Can't sell a chest, so I may as well get the wood back. And let's go see Willy. Um, let's drop some stuff in these kegs right now. Do not eat the star fruit. This is actually kind of nice right now. Because everything's like super low pressure <laughs> like I don't really have like I'm not in a rush to do anything I'm not like oh I need to hurry and make more cake I was like no I can just kind of you know I went hey I'm, I'm gonna take my time and like grab these forgeables and oh what the heck let's grab these artifact spots and you know whereas normally I'm like oh my goodness I have to hurry and do all these things so weird okay let's um find William should be able to get into his house.
Don't eat the link card. Saturday. Is he fishing somewhere? What the heck? <laughs> All right, where's Willie? Saturday in winter. Winter. Wakes up fishing outside the shop. Goes back inside the fish shop from the, from the oh fishing outside his fish shop. Hello. Maybe he doesn't show up. Maybe like he doesn't spawn until like 8.50 or something. Hello? Do I have the crab cakes on? Let me crab some cake here. Super spread! Okay, it's nine. Are you home, Willie? Oh, but wait, hold on. It's, no, it's winter 13. It's a Saturday. Win oh, Saturday day off, dumbass. Wakes up for the day, goes fishing outside the river by Leah's cottage. Whoops, that's a mistake. That's okay, we got our super speed, we'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> Yoink. I would check that quest board, but I know whatever it is is gonna be more trouble than it's worth. All right, Willie. Oh. Okay, let's get this away first. There we go. 550 gold. Hey! All right, let's grab you. Uh, so there we go. That is that quest complete. I can come back here, go boop, and I can come over here and bang that out. Oh, whoops, I guess I was like, why is Winter 14 empty? It's because Winter 14 is Ginger Isle Starfruit. All right, so, paste that there. Because I can delete that start recording reminder. Uh, all right, let's head back to the house. And, uh, sell some stuff. Let me sell some stuff first. Okay, sell, 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 sell. So, 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 um, yeah. Let's get some stuff out of my inventory here. Pop the loom in here. It's so nice that you get like the full, I the full item back. Like getting fifty wood back from those chests. Dang, wish I'd known that sooner. Uh, okay, um. So, done these kegs. Let's do a quick check of the quarry. Don't know why I'm going this way. Do a little quarry check. Screenshot. I guess, well, yeah. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. I gotta go this way anyways. I guess there's really no advantage to taking that. There's no real advantage to taking that, is there? So there's no, no kegs are ready, um, because I had I got to go to the bus, I had to walk back from the bus stop anyways. Hmm, I'll think about that. I'll see if I can sell this monster musk, the slingshot. I think you can't really do anything with. I can sell my galaxy sword. Go sell a galaxy sword for like a hundred gold or whatever you get for it. Ah, I'm stuck. There we go. Yeah, it's pretty sad how much, uh, how little you get for a galaxy sword. Need a new sword? No. 650! Wow! I'm not even gonna sell it. I'm not even gonna sell it. Screw you guys. Just because you can only get one per game, so I mean, I think, anyways. I guess you could probably buy, buy one back again for. However much they cost, 25000 or whatever. What is this? Selling a game at GameStop or something? hey -o, Topical humor. Alright. Um, let's throw in... I guess I could grab these... Uh, these guys can go. So, yeah. Sell the Monster Musk. Uh, sell the Pine Tar. Sell the Iridium Bars. And 
from Zelda Seeds. And I'll just put some... I don't really have a good place for these furnaces. <laughs> Did not think about that. I guess I could put some along here, maybe. I, I don't even know if I'm going to do anything with them, ultimately, but... Let's see if I can get five in here. Oh yeah, we're good. Whoops. There we go, alright. Uh, then I'll just put all the ores and stuff in here. And the bars and wooden as well, I guess. Uh, anything else I want to drop in there? Don't think so. Technically, I'd probably want to put these guys in here. I should deal with the geodes at some point, too. I should just crack all those open. Do I have more geodes in the desert? I feel like I do. I might, I might just go check real quick. Uh, so that... All right, let's just go quickly check in the desert and make sure I don't have any more geodes there. I thought I grabbed them all, but maybe I hadn't. I only have 33, which makes me suspicious. No, I did grab them. Okay. Great. So we'll do geodes at some point. There's no rush. Do that like, at the very end. Or never, quite frankly. We'll end up with that much money. Let's just skip it. Okay, uh, bedtime. Okay, wasn't okay. It wasn't as fast as the day as I was hoping. It is noon now. Um, ooh, you know what this means? If I'm gonna be, if I'm gonna get iron bar or copper bars from that, that means I can make more kegs. Uh, and I need to make them today or tomorrow. can't make a deconstructor, can you? No. Don't think so. Oh well. Uh, so I'll make a couple- I might make a couple more kegs just because I can. I'll have the wood, I've got some iron. I should get oak resin in the morning. Uh, okay. That's probably good for today. It's time to settle in for a long winter's nap. Almost 50,000. So, Maru, Kegs, Ginger Island is the plan for today. Maru's making moves every morning. Holy cow. Where's Maru? Is she in her room? There she is. What up, Maru? Uh, why can't I do the hug and kiss thing? That's weird. Like, hello, can we make out there? There we go. Whoops, that's not what I wanted. Can't get rid of any of these things, can you? I don't know if you can. Oh, well, whatever. Whatever. <clears throat> Alright, so... Maybe what I'll do... Hey, vegetable medley. Um, oh yeah, the night marker. I was gonna grab the pearl from the night marker. I never did that before. <clears throat> Um, so I think what I might do, let's grab three of whatever, is I'll make the kegs at the end of the day, or when I come back from Ginger Island. That will allow me to get at least one more copper thingy. So we've done Maru. Well, then maybe I'll just do kegs when I get back anyway, so I'll just grab all this stuff. More stuff might pop while I'm gone, so... And I'll take a crab cake once I get to Ginger Island. Oh, we got some more star fruit, and we have an ancient fruit done. That's lovely. I need more star fruits. Hmm. Must remember to buy more star fruit. There we go. Although, this is. I'll be able to bring a few back from Ginger Island, because this is my last planting cycle on Ginger Island. Um, so I will leave those there for now. 
Let's remember to buy star fruit. I'm gonna write that down. Uh, I went to 14. Went to 15. I'm gonna buy star fruit for greenhouse. Okay. I'll do it today if I have time, but for now, let's go to Ginger Island. Now, uh, let's not go to Ginger Island. Let's actually make some coffee first. See if I can get it all done all at once. Nice. Okay, and another copper bar, if you please. And... Da, 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 what was I doing? Oh, I mean, I guess I've got, got stuff in here I can put down. I'm going to throw this uh, ancient fruit in here somewhere, I think. Use another keg. Da, like so, there we go. Um... Okay, we'll sell a couple things, and then we'll head to Ginger Island, replant all the things. And uh, we'll come back, we'll make some kegs. Be good. Sell you, sell you, and you, and you, and you. And sell you, vegetable medley. Okay, pepper poppers we're going to use today. Alright, let's go to the G. Ah, the thought occurs to me, farming and speed. Okay, so that's... Oh, that'll work out really well, actually. We will not use crab cakes just yet. We'll use the pepper poppers. Two empty kegs in front of the house. Yes, I will take care of all those. I'll refill them with star fruit when I get back. Right now, though, I want to get these guys dealt with. Uh, quick check here. Ooh, actually, I just realized if I don't use any deluxe speed grow today, I'm not going to. I mean, technically, there are a few more days... I'd have to plant things. Like I have, what did, I, what did I say on the thing here? So technically, so today's the 14th, so I could technically plant one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four. I could technically plant until the 19th if I needed to. Be kind of a pain in the ass. Take you home with me. What can I sell? Galaxy Soul? Do, do they even sell for anything? Galaxy Souls? I would doubt it. 5,000! I stand corrected. Okay, and the Cinder Shards can go... These Warp Totems I don't think are worth anything. Sell them anyways. Uh, no point in using them with the Farm Totem there. I mean, technically there, there could be, but whatever. Um, okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. Alright, so... Uh, pepper Poppers. That's not Pepper Poppers. That's Pepper Poppers. I'll grab these Nanners while I'm here. And hit this. Give me super speed. All right. It's probably not gonna help me. It's probably gonna make me miss more crops now. Or whatever. Oh dear. Oh, right here, for example. Oh, I clicked out of the game. Okay. So one thing I forgot to do. I'm gonna go back home and do this. I forgot to bring a watering can. I'm gonna grab that. And, uh... I'm also gonna grab a bunch of stone and do some pathing. So, let's leave that here and take that one. Grab the watering can. Where's my watering can? There it is. No idea why it's there. Um... And we've got some deluxe speed grow. That's lovely. One more keg. Okay. Ginger ale. Oh, there goes Leo. Oogie! We might as well plant some stuff on the way over there. Hopefully this actually is this is actually worth it in the end. Because I keep missing planting spots. Oops, come on. Okay, let me just cycle around here. Ooh, it's stone. That's what I was going to grab. Dang it. I was going to grab stone. Stone. 
so that I could uh, put some pathing around. Oh, whoops. Knew I forgot something. Hey, coffee's done. I'll deal with that later. There's no rush. Okay, stone. Great. Uh, totem. Crap. Should have put another um, ta tapper in the re re reconstitutor thing. <sighs> you know, normally by this point I would have reset the day already. But at this point in the run, I'm like, you know what? I, it's fine. As long as I get everything replanted today, and, you know, I'll put some pathing down if there's time, and it will be good. The important thing is to get everything replanted. Apparently I missed a spot right here. Whoops. And apparently I missed a speed grow right here. Yep. Whoops. I thought I would have done so well. Oh well. This is the last, these are the last crops I'm going to be planting. Uh, I guess maybe not quite. I'll probably do some more stuff in the greenhouse, but like, this is my last big batch of, uh, of crops. Crazy. What a run it has been. What a run indeed. Missed a spot there. It's okay. Hopefully I'll get it on the way back. those guys. I am not doing this very well. This is suboptimal. Suboptimal re restart. Redo the run. Yeah, I think up and down is better. Looks like up and down is better than side to side. So why am I continuing to go side to side? Pay attention, Paul. Pay attention to what you are doing. One spot by the river? Up or down? Oh, there it is, thank you. Good call. Appreciate it. I'm one of those people that does not mind backseat gaming. Like, honestly, if I screw something up, yeah, absolutely tell me, because I'm gonna completely miss this. Like those two spots of fertilizer that I missed. Big whoops right there. A big whoopsie. Okay, now I feel like I'm it's going a bit smoother. Ah, whoops. Moving too fast. I'm not... I can't handle the speed! The speed is just tremendous. Ludicrous speed. I'm hoping the pathing will help a little bit with the weeds. I don't know how much it helps. Hopefully, I mean, using stone pathing will be better than wood pathing or whatever, but... Hopefully it'll help a little bit. Like I say, it shouldn't matter at this point. At this point, I should have more than enough starfruit to keep my kegs full for the rest of the run. Hopefully that's true. Oh my word. 
getting stuck right right in between where I want to be standing. It's missing the planting. Alright, so yeah, I will try putting pathing. I don't even know how much I'm going to need. Probably... I don't know. Maybe I'll start with 50 or so and see how far that gets me. Um, I'll try putting some pathing around. We'll see what happens. It's kind of late now, being this is my last big crop or whatever, but... A little on the late side. But, uh, you know, what do you do? Hopefully it'll help. Get a few extra starfruit. I'm actually really close. I'm so close. My next... I think probably... My, by the time I get my next big batch of starfruit wine, that next big batch will probably put me over. So I think I was getting... I'm supposed to get like nearly two and a half million. So right now I only need another 350,000 or so. Um... Once you get the cloth problem goes away too. Also true. Does it go away on Ginger Island as well though? I didn't think it I didn't think the clock worked on Ginger Island. Unless I put the clock on Ginger Island. Which I could do, actually. Why not? Don't really, don't need it on the farm. That's what I read. Sweet. So okay. So wait, no, it, it works if I put it on Ginger Island or just having it down somewhere also protects Ginger Island. Not that it matters. I can put it on Ginger Island anyways. Uh, okay, so, ooh, mercy. Yeah, that definitely <laughs> increased the quality of my harvest. Okay, um... Path. I was debating going home and putting another, uh... Putting another tapper in the, uh... Putting another tap. Oh, I can put stuff down here too. Putting another tapper in the uh, in the things, but in the reconstitutor thingy. That's okay. I'll deal with this. Can't place on. Oh, you can't place on ginger ale, but the but it placed both for. Okay, perfect. That's awesome. Sweet. Good. Oh my goodness. I keep clicking out of the game. Good info to have. We'll take that news to heart. Put on back here. Okay. So hopefully, let's make a bunch more here. Hope this will help a little bit. Let's make another twenty or so. Just keep things nice and don't want to make more than I need to. Can't put those there. Okay. All right, handful more. Oops. Okay, and then just put them all up here. Need like too lazy to count. Oh, actually, I'll go down the side as well. Let me make another, I don't know, 30 or so. Ooh, six too many. <laughs> so close. Okay. We've got, so this is, this is good. This is good. Everything's been replanted. We can sell some bananas. May as well sell the stone walkway. Sell the fiber, sell the coconuts. Um, okay, so... Uh, I've got time. Maybe I'll head over to uh, the desert and I'll get another. How many more starfruit seeds should I get? I don't know. Maybe another 50 or so? I'm going to have a couple more. 50 should be fine. I'm going to have a couple more um, harvests out of the greenhouse, for sure. So, I mean, 50 should be a pretty safe bet.
Okay, things are going well. A little slow, but they're going well. We're really going to start uh, getting through these days here pretty quick. Uh, another quick check of the quarry. Ah. I see. Well, then. Okay, well, before I do anything else... Let's go put another, <clears throat> um, whatchamacallit, tapper in the deconstructor. There we go. That's going to be another another keg. This is this is it, actually. Oh, ooh. <laughs> the thought occurs to me, this might be that big day I was hoping for. This could be the day we hit 10 mil. Wouldn't that be incredible? Wouldn't that just be a thing if we hit 10 million today? Wait a minute. I always screw this up. This time I'm going to do it right. I'm going to go to the far side first. Shout, shout, shout out to Gary Larson. Oh, I missed one. Okay, now I really need help. I need to know if I missed a keg. Because apparently, with the double speed, I did miss a keg there. Okay, I, one of my speeds just ran out. Oh, no, the other speed just ran out. Uh, alright. Another what's it? What's up, Andrew Hansel? Uh, alright. <clears throat> ah, there we go. Wouldn't it be incredible if we hit... I don't know that we will. I don't think we're going to quite hit 10 million today, but we're going to be real close, though. This is a big old batch of starfruit wine. Actually, we're going to be out of our regular quality star fruit here, too. Any second now. There we go. Nothing much. Sweet. Sounds lovely. So I was talking last week about how, you know, we got out a couple times and played some pickleball and how tired my body was with all this exercise weirdness. Um... Since my last stream, we played three times. So, <laughs> we were out Thursday, Friday, and Saturday playing pickleball. And, oh boy. It was fun, don't get me wrong. We had a lot of fun doing it, but... Good gravy. My body is weary. First and third row. Well, crap. Quarry. First row. Wait, first row on the left or on the right? It's 8.40 p.m. I don't... Left side. All right. First row and third row. Let's just scan down the third row. Oh, there it is. I see that one. Thank you. And first row. I see it right there. Beautiful. Oh, my goodness. What a team we make when you do all the work. <laughs> okay. Thank you very much, once again. I've never played this game. How is it? Professor Disco, this game's a lot of fun. Uh, don't play it like I'm playing it. Um, these challenge runs and stuff are a bit of a thing. Um, but the games are a ton of fun. And, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's hugely popular with good reason. It look exactly, it looks nothing like I, what I'm doing right now is I've set myself a challenge to, to get to a certain point in the game within a certain amount of time in game. And, um... This is not typically how you would play this game. This game's usually a lot more chill than what you're seeing on my screen. But yeah, it's super fun. Highly recommend it. This is probably one of my favorite games. Well, it is one of my favorite games. I don't know if it's if it's my favorite. I don't know if it's completely my favorite game. I don't I still have a soft spot soft what? Soft spot in my heart for Super Mario World. Um I obviously wouldn't say it's the greatest game of all time because that's, you know, it really depends on the kind of games you like and that sort of thing. But it's close. Oh, dog's in the way. Move dog, move dog, move dog, move dog. Thank you. 
Keep moving, dog. Oh, the dog's still in my way. There we go. Yeah, super fun game, though. Super fun game. Highly recommended. Um, yeah, those kegs empty. That's weird. Okay, uh, I'm gonna check the basement, too, actually, before I go outside. I'm running out of time this day, though. Oh, dear. Best game made by a single developer, then? Oof, I, I would say yes. I would say yeah. You'd be pretty hard-pressed to find a better game that's just made by one person as a passion project. That would be... I don't think I would be able to find one. I, I couldn't name one, let's say that. I could not name a better game that was developed by a single person. It's really incredible when you think about it. Like, yeah, the more you think about it, the more incredible it is. Miss one on the bottom? Oh, crap. I hope I can get all this stuff done. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Thank you. Perfect. Oh, you guys are awesome. Okay. I uh, should be able to get everything done. Ooh, am I going to get more kegs made, though? That's the question. <laughs> that is the question. Duh, I don't have any iron bars. Whoops. I only have five. Huh. So I'm making five kegs anyways. Okay, well, you know what? I mean... Where's my wood? Oh, there it is. Um, not a big deal. Because... <laughs> Um, I still have, at this point, I can still make kegs. Like, I can still make kegs for another week. Um, so there's really no rush in that way, in that sense. Alright, let's sell some stuff. And then, um... So do I start keeping oh resin? 556 Starfruit one. Heavens to Betsy. That's right, I said it. Uh Deluxe Speedgrow? It's a real shame I overbought by 183 Deluxe Speedgrow. Uh do I need to say yeah, there's no point in me keeping it at this point. Um Okay. I'll sell the dragon cutlass thingy to what's his face? Marlin. Um, so tomorrow in-game should be a pretty quick day. Oh, there's a kick right there I missed. Whoop. Uh, wow, this is overwhelming just glancing at it. My seven-year farm starting to look like this. Congrats. Thank you very much. Thank you. I think, uh, stay-at-home dad, I think I am going to pull this off. This perfection in two-year thing has been a thing, definitely. It's definitely been a thing. Uh, but I think I'm going to pull it off. Just need to make sure I get the money. Just make sure I get the money. That's all. That's why I have so many kegs. Is because I'm trying to get enough money to make sure I can pull this off. Uh, okay, so we've got starfruit on me for more kegs. We're, we're up to our gold quality starfruit. How sweet is that? Um, I think I'm actually done because I'm, I don't have any more iron or coal. Um. So, you know what, maybe in the last couple minutes I have here this day, I'll just clean out my inventory a little bit of stuff I probably don't need. And keep that on me, keep that on me, keep those on me. No idea why. Um, oh, I could put the starfruit back in the greenhouse. Starfruit, firefruit seeds back in the greenhouse. Boop, like so. 86, that's not enough, but that's okay. We can... I might just kind of wait and buy it as I need it, just to make sure I don't overbuy. Because I do have a habit of doing that. Pop one of those in there. And I think we're actually pretty good. I'll leave a spicy eel there. And I probably don't need the watering can anymore. Technically, I don't need most of my tools anymore, but whatever. We'll gloss over that. Uh, you know what else? I could probably combine these chests, actually. That one can stay as it is. Great, so... Do I have enough room in here for all this stuff? Um, got ore, but no, no coal. So, what do you do? And scythe, and... 
I think everything else is staying on me, so we're good. Okay. Whoops, bedtime. 1.50 a.m. Per look at that. Perfect timing. All right, here we go. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. 1.8 million. That puts us at pretty close to nine. Oh, so close to nine million. Oh, that just, that just, that hurts me on the inside. Oof. Oh, quest. Um, oh, okay, thank you for the cauliflower. There should be, when's the next quest coming in here? Hold on. Uh, night market. What are the daily snapshots for? Um, just for fun. Uh, I'll actually show you what I was, what I was thinking about doing was doing a, um, like a time-lapse kind of thing. So basically what I would do is I would do a video that looks a lot like this. So you can see the progression of the farm. Obviously quite not, probably not quite this fast, but, uh, you can kind of see how the farm progressed over time. Oh, a reset. Anyways, yeah, you get the idea. So yeah, I have a, that's the one mod I have is the daily screenshot mod. So I don't have to worry about taking, so I don't forget to take a screenshot every day. Uh, okay, so I could get the pearl from the night market. Do I care that much? Probably not. Um, I don't know, something to do, I guess. Plant hit growing fire dead. <laughs> Alright, let's, so again, quick, I'm just gonna do a very quick check of, uh, kegs. And I'll probably just grab one of these guys. Just to speed things up a little bit. Unfortunately, there isn't a whole lot I can do to wait for the night market to start, that's the problem. So, do I really want to wait? That is the question. Oh, more, more oil present. Again, I'm pretty sure I'm done with kegs at this point. I'm pretty sure I'm not going to be making any more. Hmm. A thought occurs to me. Um. This can get deconstructed. And all, like, all of these, uh. These braziers can go. I think I've got another one down here somewhere. There it is. This will give me a piece of marble, hopefully. There's one over there by the fish. Um, anything else down here? Oh, yep, there is. This will give me probably a skull thing. Okay, uh, so that is... Uh, so we'll check... So we just did the quarry. I don't need to worry about that. Just did this. Quick look inside the house. The heavy tappers will break down to radioactive bar that you get 3,000 each. Thank you. Good call. Worth way more. And I have a lot of these guys, too. Forgot about that. That's an excellent point. I have a lot of radioactive tappers, let me tell you. I don't mind leaving the regular tappers there just to get... Although... Maybe I will cut those trees down there. Because at this point... So I've got two more weeks in game, right? So I'm going to get, like, two more... From the regular tappers, I'm going to get two more of whatever. Um, how much does an oak resin sell for? Oak resin sells for 150. Copper bar sells for 60. So it actually is worth it for that. No radiation protection. Um, so I'll leave the regular ones until like the last week or whatever. Oh, aiming down, that is slow. There we go. I've got some more over here somewhere. There's one. Oh man, good call on that. That's gonna, that's gonna make a huge difference. Oof. Yike. Scary. How many do I have? I have 19 so far. Wow. 
forgot that I had that many. Okay, uh, what else do we have? Oh, there's a heavy one. This tree doesn't even have anything on it, I don't think. Let's just cut that down. Any other heavies? No, this tree doesn't have anything on it. Uh, that's not heavy. That's not heavy. Okay. Sweet. That's 20. Yike. That's 21. Wait, I didn't look at the star fruit. Okay, we're good. Uh, also going to need a few days to break them all down with only one deconstructor. True story. How do you get... Hold on a second. Can I get another one? Deconstructor. How do you get one? 20 chi gems. How many chi gems do I have? Probably I have one. Forget it. Okay, we're sticking with one. But I will start breaking them down now. So maybe... Hmm. Hmm. I really don't want to play all these days. Um, I can make another keg, though. Oh, wait a second. Wait a minute. I think I just sold a milk resin. Crap. Um, <laughs> okay, I can't make any more kegs. Uh, okay, uh, that's fine. Um, <clears throat> I guess I have other tappers going as well, but... Um, Again, I should be fine. I'm just, I'm just gonna start sleeping days, honestly. I should be fine, but... You know what? Screw the night market. So we've checked kegs, we talked to Maru, we did whatever. Let's get to the end of this run. 30,000. So forget the night market. Deconstructor, whatever. We'll do what we can. Um... There we go. Check kegs in the morning. More may finish through the day, but again, we just had a big harvest, so our next big harvest is supposed to be, what, next Monday, I guess? Or, no, next Sunday. Oh, I missed a keg there. Um, so, yeah. I'm not too worried at this point. I mean, honestly, I just need the 10 million. It's just, that's all I need. I just need the 10 mil. Alright, sell you. What did I just do? Did I just sell something? I have no idea if I just sold something. Hope it wasn't important. Uh, sell those. Okay. I, mean, I guess I could wait for the deconstructor to finish something, but honestly, what am I even doing at this point? I don't. <laughs> the problem is I don't have 19 days. I probably should wait. I mean, I could go. Uh, goodness. All right, hold on. Let's go see if we can. If there's like a chi quest we can get that we can bang out real quick and. There's something that we can do quickly just to get one more. It will help. It'd be a huge help, so. Let's go have a look. Hope I get this done more quickly, but we'll see what happens. Might be a long stream. All right, what do we have? Uh, I can get 10 for 50,000 points in Junimo Kart Endless Mode. Hard no. Uh, mine elevator has been reset Ah, bottom of the mines? Yeah, this I'll do. So here's what we're gonna do to do this. I have like 60 or so staircases uh, in the desert and I have a whole bunch of stone. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna do that. Just gonna bang this out, get the 50 chi gems. Stairs all the way, absolutely. What's the luck today? And it's best luck and I'm gonna have, and I can use um, uh, magic rock candy. Talk about a waste. <laughs> Talk about a waste. <laughs> Magic rock candy in the regular mines. <laughs> but I'll be able to get two more decon two more deconstruct. I'll be able to get three deconstructors at the end of it. So, okay, so let's grab a magic rock candy. I've got. So let's grab uh, some spicy eel. Bomb sixty-one stairs. Whole bunch of stone. Um. 
a little bit of food, I guess. I'll treat it like a Skull Cavern run. I've got way too much crap on me. Um, whatever, this is fine. Everything's fine, nothing's not fine. All right. We're absolutely gonna bang this out. <clears throat> it's best luck, I'm gonna use Magic Rock Candy. Um, that, oh, did I grab the ginger ale? Did I grab the ginger ale? No crap. Um. Okay. Let's do the following. We'll quickly deal with my inventory. My inventory is full. Uh, there's gotta be some stuff I can sell. I thought there was something I could sell. Uh, I could sell. Um. The bananas. That'll do for now. And let's do this. I'm gonna put some star fruit in this chest. Boop boop. There we go. I may as well put that in there as well. Then what I'm going to do... That chest is pretty full, but I've got five on me, so let's just grab those. Put this down here, and this is going to be the chest of things to deconstruct. So, deconstruct those, those chests, that, 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 those, um, those, that one. Okay. Put that one in there. We'll deal with that later. We've got a magic rock candy. We've got... I'm not going to need crab cakes because I don't want to have the food effect. Um, I might just grab two magic rock candy. What the heck? Um, rest is food. Don't need to have the wood on me. Everything else looks pretty good. So let's pop back to the desert. Grab another magic rock candy. Because why not? Um, we'll grab whatever else. Uh, ginger ale. Ginger ale's good. Grab all the magic rock candy. Just clean this out, screw it. Alright, let's go to the mine. Let's go, let's go down 100 levels fast. As quickly as humanly possible. Or even faster from that. Than that. Even faster than that. I said from that, I meant than that. Because English is hard. Even though I literally, it's the only language I speak. And even that, not well. So that gives you an idea of how hard English is. Alright. Hello, hey, Master of Lie. How you doing? Magic rock candy. Ginger ale. We got mad luck. Why didn't I get a ladder from that first? One. This is kind of weird not being super fast, but whatever. We've got so much luck. Can you even have more luck than this in the game? Like, honestly, I've got the luck charm, I've got magic rock candy, ginger ale, and it's best luck. All right, you know what? I'm done. I got 61 stairs. Let's start using them. Not trying to mess around with this. Not trying to mess around with this RNG. Not without a safe pilot. That's sweet. Literally max luck. Not going to bother picking anything up even. I, mean, I probably could, but whatever. So far, so good. We hit level 7. Level 8. It's, it's real nice. Level 9. Level 10. Um, it did... It, I did it once to the sea in Skull Caverns, and you get treasure floors all the way down. Nice. That's sweet. Ooh, it's old tricky crab, hey? I kind of have to keep an eye on the time, because I, I would like to avoid using the stairs if possible, but like a level like this where I'm just not getting... There it is. That one I was pretty close to, to using a, a stair. <clears throat> Oops. There's a ladder. I should probably be checking for ladders before I... Uh, use one. Might be one and just out of sight somewhere. 17, it's going well. Hey, some radioactive ore. What the heck, why not? Alright, these guys can piss off. I'm gonna grab the radioactive ore first. 
Bye, Felicia. Quick check for a ladder. Nothing. All right. Whoops. Hello. There we go. Uh, I got a new tattoo last week. I'm already playing my next one. Nice. Is it Stardew Valley related by any chance? That was a joke. Anyways. Oh, my favorite level. Oh, I need to eat something here, actually. Uh, let's ladder out of here first. And then let me chow down on perhaps an that purple mushroom. Nice. Okay. Yeah, these levels suck. Get those guys out of my way here. Oh my goodness, they got laddering. Not waiting around to see how that turns out. Ooh, more radioactive ore. I should not be wasting my time on this radioactive ore. Oh, I'm almost dead again. This might call for a ladder. Or some food. 25, not bad, not bad. I'm gonna, at some point, I'm probably gonna have to spam stairs, but maybe I'll do that once I get, because <clears throat> so I've got, what, 60 stairs left? So once I get to level 40, that's kind of how I think of that. I know I can spam stairs at that point. How much more do you have? How much more what? Stairs or levels? Or tattoos? Tattoos, none. Um, stairs, 57. Levels, a lot. Oh, I see a stair. Oh, got a cheat gem. Nice. Ooh, I need to eat. Um, this area is infested. Uh, levels. Uh, we're going to get to level 120, so I'm at 28 right now. It says way up in the corner up there. Um, the barf ghost levels are good to skip. Yeah. The old barf ghosts. Stay away from that guy. There we go. Ooh, the dark levels. My other favorites. Level 30 to 40 in the mines are levels I never visit. I never visit them because they're so, they're so dark. Can y'all move a little bit? Like, jinkies, gang. Jinkies. Ladder. Oh, there. This one open already. Whoops. Um, catching history of the sitcom and watching you play this. Nice. Are you being educated on sitcoms? Oh, nice. Fast ladder. Lovely. At least these ghosts are slow. They're really annoying, but they're... At least they're slow. I'm not going to lie. With my streaming lights on right now, a bit of a hard time seeing what's going on on these levels. Oh, there's a ladder right there. Wasting my time. I might just ladder away from this one, actually, because... Then I'll be able to see again. Okay, uh, time to eat my last silver quality mushroom. Quick ladder. Totally went the wrong way there. We'll gloss over that. Alrighty. I guess I should be breaking rocks while I was thinking I'll just go trek for ladders, but I should probably be breaking rocks. Level 42, we're doing well. We're a third of the way down. Uh, we're making decent time. Getting pretty close to the point where I can be a little bit more liberal with my use of ladders. Speaking of which, there's one. Ah, keep hitting the wrong button. There we go. Okay, I just ran out of something. What was it? Uh, it was the ginger ale. How Gilligan's Island lasted more than one episode. Uh, last stream for the run. Last stream for this run. This is it. I'm going to finish this today come hell or high water.
If it means doing a 10 hour stream, that's what I'm gonna do. It's not gonna take that long. I would normally just be sleeping through days. Actually, the night market's open. Maybe I will go grab the, uh, the pearl just for funsies. Do, 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 do. I got those notes wrong. Do, 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 do. Something like that. Uh, you know what? Ladder time. Piss off, you guys. Alright, where was I? Him, <clears> him. <throat> Alright. We are getting through this. Uh, hmm. At least there aren't too many baddies here. Oh, yeah, those spitty ghosts. Yeah, those spitty ghosts. Spitty ghosts are not a good time. Avoid. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. No, 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 no. Don't make me hungry. Oh, my goodness. Yes. You know what? I'm not messing around with these guys. Mm, if I don't see a ladder, I'm going to skip to level 60. Helen Highwater, she's so annoying. <laughs> 57, 58, 59. Don't see any spitty ghost guys. There, I do see one, I do see one, I do see one. Hold on. Nope, 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 nope. We out. All right, I got 47 ladders left. This area isn't... Actually, there aren't too many baddies here. Okay, come get me, spiders. Come get me. Come closer so I can hit you. There we go. Thank you. Oh, wait a second. I just realized. Maybe I shouldn't have uh, used all those stairs right there. Okay, this is taking too long. There's a ladder. Ugh, goodness. Okay, yep. Nope, 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 nope. That's a hard no right there. Oh, crap. The problem is this lasts forever, too. It's like... Get me out of here. This effect lasts a really sticking long time. Ginger ale fix it? Oh, okay, sweet. We'll just drink one right now, then. Right, good point, because it's a, a drink effect. Sweet, good call. Fortunately, I have seven ginger ale left. Oh my goodness, I can't hit the rocks. Eight ten p.m. Okay, I'm starting to get a little bit worried. I was hoping to get this done in one day. Unfortunately, I'm not very good at Stardew Valley. So, this may not be a thing that happens. This level's massive. Oh, there's a ladder. Saw the, the ghost guy over there, so we'll go this way instead. Okay, I've got lots of luck. Just be patient, you'll get a ladder. Not that we really have time to be patient, but you know, whatever. Uh, this is getting bombed. Uh, actually, you know what I might do? Just eat that. Eat that too, why not? Um, that we're just going to throw away, that we're going to throw away, that we're going to throw away. Pressure nozzle I might be able to put in the deconstructor, actually. Um, okay, let's bomb that. Oh, my magic rock candy ran out. Let's grab another one of those. Well, I mean, I was going to go to the night market, but, uh, level 69, nice. But, I guess I'm going to be in these mines the rest of the day. Oh, there's a ladder. There we go. Alright, no more spitty ghosty guys. I see a ladder already. I was like, why am I not moving so fast? Because I don't have double speed now. I have single speed with my magic rock candy. And luck with everything else. Oof. It's going to be... A little rough, having to go down all those rocks. 
Oh, this is going to be a, uh, whatchamacallit? The Mega Bomb. I don't have any Mega Bombs. I can't make any Mega Bombs. That's embarrassing. All right, let's just throw a bomb over here, and then we'll throw a bomb. Actually, that might be enough. There we go. That's all I need. That's all I need. 10.40 p.m. I'm not making this here. Oh, wait a second. Uh, no, I'm not, actually. Now that I think about it. Because I only have 40... I need to get to level 80, basically. And then I can just spam stairs and hope I make it to level 120. So if I can make it four more levels without using ladders... Then we're just gonna spam ladders. Spam stairs, yep. Sp spam stairs. Why is the spam staring at me? Uh, okay, you know what? That's La Bomba. Wow, okay. Guess I'm not that lucky today. Wow, hello. Um, hello, anybody? Bueller? Bueller? Still gotta try and make level 80. And in theory, I should be able to get those levels in a couple hours in game, in theory. Oh, there's a ladder right there. Uh, is there a ladder here anywhere? Nope, but there's gonna be a bomb. There we go. Put a bomb there. Put a bomb there. Health is doing okay. This level... Oh, beautiful. Look at that. The luck comes through for me. All right, it is time to get to level 120. Ooh, although... Can't resist. There's an open stair there. I will obviously take an open stair if there's an open stair. Uh, let's eat... Uh, actually, let me eat one of these magma caps instead. Okay, and then... Flip to the staircase. It's 1 a.m. Ugh, I really want to get this, but I kind of need to go. This is a lot of levels to make, even in this amount of time. Am I going to make this? I don't know if I am, actually. Whoops. Oh my goodness, that was a waste of stairs. Kind of do like a quick little scan in case there's an open staircase somewhere. Whoops, that was a waste. Crap. Yeah, I'm not convinced I'm gonna make this. I'm not gonna make it. I'll try to get to 110 at least. Alright, that's it. There we go, got to 110. Crap, well that sucks. That's okay. You know what, we got 100,000, so we should be over 9 million now. So this is good. That's actually really sad. I'm quite dis disappointed about that. Oh well. Let's talk to Maru. Oh, she gave me a bomb. Thanks, Maru. Alright, my inventory is just chock full of stuff. Let's go sell some stuff first. Uh, Linus found me. Jody gave me some... I don't have any, anything in my, any inventory space. Okay. So, what am I selling? Um, pressure nozzle. Okay, hold on a second. Because I'm pretty sure you can craft one. Pressure nozzle. No, you cannot. So, I'll just sell it and make my 200 gold, I guess. Um, what else are we selling? Lucky lunch. You know, I might use the Lucky Lunch today, actually. No, there's no point. I'm just going to stare my way down. Yeah, I'm just going to stare my way down at the bottom. Um, inventory is looking fine, I would say. Let me throw another Heavy Tapper. In there, like so. Sell those guys. Uh, I didn't grab any star fruit. That was a mistake. So let's 
grab that one, I guess. Sorry, Mara. So today we'll just bang out the rest of the mines and, uh... Oops. And then we'll get the deconstructors. So we'll de start deconstructing more stuff. And then, yeah, and then we will actually start sleeping days. <laughs> I keep saying that. I mean, is it actually going to happen? Who can say? Who can say? And my inventory is full again. <laughs> Do not need this much stone, so I'm going to sell a thousand stone. Mm-hmm. And... Okay. That should be fine for now. Inventory management is horrendous. There we go. Okay, so let's just... Uh, I think what we're going to do... Actually, let me throw in... Do I have some coal? I do have some coal now. Let me just... Oh, actually, I'll throw some stuff in these preserve jars, too. How long do preserve jars take? Anybody know? Or does it depend on the... What you put in it. Two to three days. Okay. So that's fine. Um, times base vegetable price or two times base fruit price. I wonder if I should... I should probably check and see what I'm actually putting in there now. Crystal fruit? Chris, oh, wow, I put crystal wrong. Crystal fruit. Uh, base price is 450 Cactus fruit. Base price is 75 Yike. Uh, corn, 50. Melons, 250. Hot pepper, 40. Grape, 80. So, definitely the crystal fruit. Probably should have been doing that all along. And then maybe a melon. That's going to be the highest value, I would think. Alright, so sell the wine, sell the pickles. Um, okay, now we're going to throw some stuff in the furnaces, like the radioactive ore. Actually, now that I think about it, I probably don't need... Um, I probably don't actually need to worry about smelting any of this stuff, really. So let's throw in gold, I guess? I don't know. May as well. Every little bit helps. Okay. Uh, anything else I care about in here? These rare crows. I might just stick them inside the house. Just to get a bit of stuff out of this chest. Uh, what's the luck today? Um, I forgot to watch the TV last week. Last Sunday, I think. I started on the... What day did I start? On the 12th? The 15th was... Oh, no! Oh, no. I think I got away with it. I think I got away with it. Um, <laughs> I think I got away. There should only be two things I'm missing here. There should only be two recipes. Both of them are right there. There's nothing else I'm missing. No. Okay, I got away with it. I got away with it. <laughs> oh. If I screw that up, that's like run over. Uh, okay, so let's do, let's just do this. Let's just say um, twenty fifth, uh, no, twenty first and twenty eighth. Oh yeah, so twenty first, winter twenty one. Watch the TV, 
and that's also the same advice for winter 28 because that's gonna that's gonna be when we actually get perfection oh how'd you get away with it there was no recipe on the 15th of winter i don't think um if i look at cooked dishes and i look at recipe source we find the queen of sauce so fall spring winter year one winter year two um summer winter year two on the 14th lobster bisque apparently i had that already somehow apparently i mean i have made it i think hopefully haven't made that and haven't made that so there's only there's only two recipes i'm missing so i've made the lobster bisque somehow oh, i got that queen of sauce yeah uh wherever that is no idea I don't even know what it looks like. It looks like that. There it is. Yeah, I have made a lobster bisque. So somehow I, oh, because I got it from the, I got it in the mail from Willie. That's how, that's how I got that one. Um, so that would have been the one I missed if I hadn't watched the TV. It's a lobster bisque, but you get it from in the mail from Willie at Nine Hearts, so we're good. Uh, and then winter year two, the twenty first, I get bruschetta. And then the 28th of winter, I get the shrimp cocktail. So we're good. Willie, so Willie did save my run. Thanks. Shout, shout out to Willie. All right. So um, have I done all the kegs? I think I have. Good one. Yeah, that was <laughs> that was a foolish oversight. That's why I'm going to be save scumming if I need to. Let me tell you. Okay, let's go finish. Oh, let's go check luck. That's what I'm going to do. Luck. Luck is best luck again. I might save the staircases then. Uh, let's leave the rock candy, but let's grab um, Lucky Lunch. And I'll leave the ginger ale. I'll go Lucky Lunch, and then I'll go uh, triple shot for speed. All right, let's go finish this up. Let's get our 50 chi gems. <clears throat> shoot over to Ginger Island. Grab, uh, whatchamacallit. What am I doing here? Uh, I'll go over to Ginger Island. Actually, I want this chest. I can get 50 wood out of this. I'll grab this too while I'm here. Uh, Alright. <clears throat> so yeah, we'll, we'll get to the bottom of the mines. We'll go to Ginger Island. Get two more, three more deconstructors. Because I should have 60 uh, Chi Gems by then. Is running. Uh, should be. Hopefully. Also, I gotta walk there anyway. Let's go have a look. Oh, I guess I didn't have to. But I'll go have a look. I'm pretty sure I put something in there. But yeah, I'm gonna have a quick look. It is on the go. All right. The 17th. This is not going as quickly as I would have liked. We are going to get through this tonight. We are absolutely going to get through this tonight. All right. Level 110. I forgot to actually eat the lucky lunch. There we go. So we've got plus three luck. Not quite as much as yesterday, but probably going to be enough. Hopefully it'll be enough to get me through the next 10 levels. Oh, there's a ladder right there. Without having to use too many stairs. That is the hope. These guys actually move, seem to move a lot faster when... Uh, oh, there's a ladder. <clears throat> they seem to move a lot faster when... Uh... Oh, dear. They seem to move a lot faster when the levels are on hard mode. Run away. Oh, there's a ladder down here. I just got blasted. There isn't a ladder down there. I thought there was. It's the old fake ladder. I hate those things. Really disappointed. Really disappointed. Still disappointed. There's a ladder. Don't care about this guy. Probably eat something pretty quick here. Uh, let's eat uh, Magma Cat. Okay. I can't remember. I think ladders can spawn under the, uh, the, the ore nodes, can't they? I feel like they can. Oh, there's a ladder over there. Level 115. Very nice. The 
They can't under ores? Okay. That's too bad. Hoping to narrow it down a little bit. Level 160. Anything looking promising? No. Wow, okay. Get wrecked, nerd. Alright. 117. That's not the rock, rock I wanted to hit. 118. We are super close. 119. Ooh, a rare disc. 120, baby. There we go. All right. 52. Oh, I only had one chi gem. Right. I thought I had 10 for some reason. Fine. Okay, let's... Uh, so we got our 50 chi gems. Let's go to... Ginger Island. Let's spend my uh, my fortune here. Uh, for some reason, I'm moving more slowly right now. Let's drink that. <clears throat> Anything else I want to throw away? Let's get rid of the slime. Pick up the odd forageable. All right. I hate to not pick things up if they're like it's right there. I hate to like not pick them up. Okay, so sell, sell, sell that. Uh, sell those two. Sell that. Don't sell that. Might preserve jar that. We'll have to see. Sell the bat wings. Uh, sell the ruby. Sell the rare disc. And that's probably good for now. Let's throw another heavy tapper in there. Deal with the inventory. Oh, I can put another radioactive ore in there. No, I can't. Um, that's probably fine for now. Sell that. Okay, right, let's quickly pop over to Ginger Island. Grab a cup. Deal with that later. <laughs> grab a couple more deconstructors. Going to be worth all of the money. You know what? I do. I have any crab cakes on me still? No. Whoops. That's a mistake. Could use the speed right now. Hopefully, having done this, the last few days in game will be. Much faster. In the last couple, couple of weeks. Yike. Uh, over here. Alright. Yoink. Just for confirmation, so we're all on the same page. Uh, as we can see here, I just need another uh, 870,000 uh, to get the golden clock, which is up here. And then everything else except for the recipes is done. So it says 89%, but I mean, there's literally only three things I have left to do <laughs> to get perfection. And one of them has to wait until the last day of the year. So, um, yeah, it's a whole thing. Grab a coconut while I'm here. All right, so back to the farm. Got some more stuff deconstructing. We'll get some more stuff smelting. We'll get some more stuff in kegs. Um, I might consider moving this, actually. I might put them over here. There we go. Nailed it. Thank you, Wathen, for the tip. All right, so. One a radioactive ore. And the rest is going to be gold. And then we will go to bed. Uh, after I after I do the kegs. There we go. Do I have starfruit on me? Yes, I do. Nice. Just one. There we go. There we go. We're getting close. We are getting super close to having... Actually, these farm totems could potentially come in handy. Uh, we're getting super close to having what we need to have. I might sell these magma caps, though. Yeah, I might have to th sell those. Uh, I also think I need to check the greenhouse today. I feel like triple shot is something I need more of. Alright, these guys. 
do I really care about this right now? I might wait and let them sync up, honestly. Like, this is not a thing that I need to have happening. Ooh, apparently I missed a day with the triple shot because the trees have three fruits on them. Normally they only have two. How did I miss planting star fruit in the, the spots on the thing up there? Why is there star fruit holes? Why are there holes in my star fruit? Why is there a hole in my star? There's a hole in my star fruit. Can I ask your grandparents about that one? Okay. All right, great. We'll leave the oak resin, let it sync up. Maybe I'll get it on like Sundays or something. Dear Eliza. Okay, so I'm gonna sell some fruitses. Sell the oak resin. Um, sell the rate right bars. Okay, so tomorrow in game, I'm gonna go to bed right now. Grab the diamond first. Uh, and we'll put in some coffee as well. <laughs> I barely have any kegs left to put star fruit in. All right, we're going to bed. Screw it. Time to start bouncing through these days. 200,000. Super, super close. We are super close. Where's Maru? There's Maru. What up, Maru? Okay, I'm gonna throw in some coffee in these kegs. Just to kind of get the coffee dealt with. There we go. And then I will replace the coffee with starfruit. So we will wait for the... Uh, for the coffee to finish before I go to bed this day. Weird. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna put that one in there. Uh, I will also check the quarry as well and stuff. I think it's I think the quarries are Sunday thingies, but we'll see. I'll just double check. It. Ooh, look at all the things that we have access to now. Um. And we're getting real close to finishing these. Uh, those guys. Uh, I don't want to disturb Polly's on a roll. Can anyone advise me about fishing the legendary ones? Just stand where they are supposed to be and keep casting and hope it's just endurance. A um, little bit of that. A little bit of that. What I would recommend doing is um, George. Do I really feel like doing something for George? Uh, what I'd recommend doing is um, getting food that has a fishing buff if you have a recipe for something like that. Get to level 10 fishing. That's going to make your life easier. Use a trap bobber as well. Um, a trap bob or something that you can make and use for a thing like that. Um, what else? Who else has tips for uh, stay at home dad? 10% chance to hook. I mean, yeah, as far as actually hooking one, it's just, you're just praying, basically. You're just kind of praying it works out. But as far as catching one, um, those things I just, I said uh, a second ago. Um, what else? Yeah, just kind of give yourself any advantage you can when it comes to catching one. Deep water is best unless you have bubbles. Absolutely. Absolutely. Screenshot. I should have... Did I bring the farm totems with me? There's nothing here. I might just... Uh, there is nothing done. So I might just use the farm totem, because why the heck not? But yeah, it's just a grind. It's just a grind to get those things. So I need to wait for the coffee to finish. Yeah. I think. Yeah. Definitely need to wait for the coffee to finish. There we go. Speak of the devil. Should be a bit more finishing. Thank you. We are gonna, I'm just gonna wait one more. Th okay. We are getting super close. And we're gonna pop those three in there like so. Sell a few more things, but you only need 600,000. 
We are so close. How much does energy tonic sell for? I don't I feel like it doesn't sell for very much. Energy tonic. Uh sells for five hundred. Well, a thousand to a thousand. I'm also gonna deal with some more inventory stuff. Stairs. Mining food. Um okay. Oh, I was gonna put some more. I put my chest in uh no, I'm gonna grab uh, I don't know. Grab a bracer for next time. We're, we're going to be done the heavy tappers tomorrow. Sweet. Okay. Um, anything else I want to do before I go to bed? Uh, just make more triple shot. Just hooked on tonic. Worked for me. All right. There we go. Just Oh, there's more kegs up there. We're just filled with old, old school references today, aren't we? Holy cow. Hooked on tonic. Gonna give it 10 more minutes, make sure I don't miss any others. Or until 9, 10 a.m., I guess. Nothing. All right. Let's go to bed. And uh, empty keg left top room. There it is. Thank you. Man alive. Check, check out Eagle Eye, Eagle Eye Wathman over here. Oh, Donny Bonix. Right, I'm going to sell this stuff. Man, I'm telling you, I'm so stinking close. Not what I wanted to do. I wanted to put that in there. All right, we oh, we're so close. Oh my word, we're so close. The golden clock is what's killing me on the inside right now. I'm not gonna lie to you. The golden clock is just killing me. Uh, we didn't get a pro from the night market. So uh, the 19th, there is a quest to give Gus a coconut. Oh, it's 200,000. We're only 400,000 away from this golden clock. Ugh, my word. I'm so antsy. What up, Mara? Oh, she gave me a little bomb. Thanks, Mara. Alright, I should start using triple shots with impunity. We're so close to having this done. My word. My stars. Maybe if I have enough, uh... I get them all there? I think so. Maybe if I have enough, um... Stone? What? Get out of here. Stone. Pfft. I'll do tappers then if you're gonna give me that. Um, if I have enough, uh... If I end up, like, making a ton of money or whatever, what I might do, to be honest with you, is, um... I might, uh... Oh, Linus sent me a uh, catfish. Thank you. Gus wants a coconut. I have a coconut for Gus. We'll deliver that immediately. Um, I might, uh... Do, like, the Pam house upgrade. We can watch that cutscene. I think, potentially, depending on how early we get the money. Um... And uh, I might buy the Return Scepter as well. I don't think I'm going to have quite that much money, but a guy can dream. It would be nice if we did. Alright, 64 Starfruit Wine is nice. And a Catfish. And some Gold Bars since we're back to Bars. And a Cherry Bomb. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Drop a couple more tappers in. And, um... Maybe another brazier, I guess? Might give me some wood or something. Alright, let's go give Gus a coconut. And that will actually be the last story quest in the entire game. Be the last story quest. Hopefully, I can, like, break into Gus's bedroom. Should be able to. Hopefully he's awake. I can't remember what time he leaves his room and heads to the to the counter. Oh, he's awake. Sweet. Gus. There you go. Beautiful. Flip over to here. Check that off. And <laughs> we're down to two things of bruschetta, which I get in two days' time. And shrimp cock, could somebody please remind me on Sunday, the 21st of winter, to watch the freaking TV? 
because if I don't, I'm going to be sad boys. Going to be a very, very sad time. TV freaking. Freaking TV. Alright, so let's just grab three of whatever. Could probably check the um, greenhouse. There's probably some more coffee. Like considering I'm not, I'm sleeping through most of the days, it really doesn't matter very much. Oh, and there's oh crap. I do I even have enough starfruit seeds to do this? I don't even know. I mean, the good news is that this is all hyper speed growth, so I should be. I should look at that though. There's no point in me planting anymore if I'm not going to have time to harvest it. Then again, not that it matters. Well, it kind of... Uh, hmm, it shouldn't matter. I'm only 400,000 gold away. I should be fine. Um, got 19 triple shot. I'm debating using my, um, maybe like in the last week or whatever, I won't make any more triple shot. Um, maybe in the last week in game, I'll just use every keg I have to, to keg everything. Well, I have six starfruit seeds left, so basically I'm going to need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So I need at least six more. I'll leave the... oh, resin. Whatever. Um, we're almost done deconstructing absolutely everything we have to deconstruct. That is wild. That's just crazy. Put that chest down by accident. Okay, let's sell a couple things. Where are we selling? Bone fragments, silver quality apricots, mangoes, bananas, cherries, hardwood, uh, some stone, so like half of that stone and that stone, uh, mixed seeds, and I'm tempted to sell the copper bars. How many do I have right now? Got 20. I'm gonna start selling them. So we're super close, Mike. We are super close. Ugh, we're so close. <laughs> just, oh, it's just... Oh, it's, we're so close. I just need 400,000 gold. <laughs> and maybe some more kegs to put coffee, coffee in. I literally just need 400,000 gold and for the next two Sundays to happen for me to get the last two recipes. And then I'm done. I did talk to... Mario already today, yep. Yeah. Okay, so good. So we checked. Uh, uh, let me just do a quick quarry check. I don't, like I say, I think they're going to be done on Sunday. It's worth a check. Worth a little look-see. Uh, screenshot. Uh, nothing. All right. Um, I'm not going to bother using a uh, farm totem. We'll save that for another time. Ooh, a crystal fruit. That can go in a preserve jar. Uh, okay. So, back to the house. And we'll go to sleep. Grab this on the way, why not? And then we'll be down to the last nine days or whatever. Hold on. Actually, let's throw some stuff out here. Let's sell that. And I think that's it. Uh, we'll put that in there and that in there. And the last three things we have to deconstruct right there. Now, I only have eight coal, so let's use it. Beautiful. Um, keep like ten of each, maybe. Don't have any iron, but, you know, whatever. Um, anything else I want to sell? Yes, the radioactive ore can definitely go. I'm not going to be getting any more. Got three. Oh, okay. Let's make. 
iron, I guess. I don't know. There we go. Okay, now we've got everything smelting that we can smelt. Uh, I don't... If I'm not mistaken, it's not worth buying... I don't think it's worth buying the coal to make the bars, then sell the bars. I don't think... I think coal is so expensive now, it's not worth doing. So, basically, any ore I can just sell. Let's just go to bed. We'll refill the coffee coffee kegs tomorrow. Not 200,000. <laughs> oh, yike. Oh my goodness, that keg grind is real, and it happened. We're at 983,000. Heavens to Betsy. Heavens to absolute Betsy, I tell you. Alright, so what was I putting in there? Crystal fruit and a couple of melons can go in the preserve jars. Alright, that all gets sold. Um, grab these bars and get them sold. I don't have anything else to deconstruct, I don't think. No. Plus, deconstruct this chest. Can't sell it, so may as well break it down. Grab all these bars. I will keep a few, um, irons. Sell the rest of the thingies. Rest of the, uh, the gold bars. Did I miss one up there? No, I don't think so. Uh, the fish wants something. Should I give the fish something? What do the fish want? Do they want a triple shot espresso? Five wild bait? Y'all aren't getting five wild bait. Okay, uh, again, quick check of the quarry. The wrong totem. Sloth the fish. Oh, good point. Yeah, I should do that. Should definitely do that. Oh, screenshots. <laughs> I haven't actually caught a fish in this game. Uh, nothing's done. I haven't actually caught a fish in this game in so long. I'm not even sure where my fishing rod is. It's got to be in one of my chests at home, but um, that's a good idea. I should go do that. Oh my goodness, I'm so close. I need 170,000. What's 13 What's 13 times 3150? 40,000. It's not enough. Might take a couple days for us to get there, but we will get there. Alright, ooh, we got lots of stone. I might start selling some wood. Um, sell this for you more. Um, mum, 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 sell a diamond. Oh, I guess I could do geodes. I could just sell them, though, honestly. I don't know if I want to go to all the trouble of doing geodes. It would take such a long time. Trying to get this done quickly. Like, quickly IRL. That's supposed to quickly in game time. Alright, let's grab these fish. Whoops. Hey, what's up, Dev? How you doing? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. We're super close to finishing this, uh... Finishing this challenge. This is the last one here, I think. Empty the pond. Yes. Great. Alright. Let's sell seven largemouth bass. Totes worth it. Boop. Sell that, sell the wood. Sell the already more. You know what? I think I'm just gonna sell these geodes. As much as it pains me. I'm just gonna sell them. I just don't want to take the time to to crack them all open, so let's just sell them. Sell them as they are. How long did it take you to finish the community center? I finished the community center, I think it was on the 13th of fall, I think. It was it was pretty early. It was pretty early. I did I was Everything kind of came together super well, and everything kind of just worked out, so... Got away with it. Because the hype is IRL. Uh, okay, so... Coffee can just sit, I guess. Okay, tomorrow. Must. Watch. The TV. Must. Watch. The TV. 50,000. Not enough. That, that was fast. It, it was super fast, yeah. Super fat. Well, I wanted to get the ginger out as quickly as po oh my goodness, quickly as possible. Queen of Sauce, Bruschetta, Bang Bang. Talk to Maru. 
Gave me another bomb. She's give. Why is she finding all these bombs in her scrap pile? That's my question. Bruschetta has been made. We literally have. I'm gonna check it off my list. Shrimp cocktail left, which happens a week from today. We got one week. Okay. Okay. Now there's a key point here. Today is the last day I can put starfruit in kegs. Today is the last day I can put starfruit in kegs. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab all the starfruit, all the starfruit wine that's done, and we're going to go see. Um, we're going to go see what's his face, Pierre, and we're going to get Pierre. We're going to sell all the stuff directly to Pierre. Pause and cooking equipment. We're going to sell all the stuff directly to Pierre. Um, because I have a feeling. I'm hopeful. I'm hopeful. Because basically any starfruit I get after today, whatever starfruit I don't use today, um, will not finish the, as wine. So there's no point in me putting any starfruit Um, there's no point in me putting anything... Oh, I shouldn't be doing that. I should be doing the quarry first, actually. Um, I was unlucky. I was trying to get the fruit cave. I don't know if I'm unlucky, but all I was getting was spice berries. It's random. Yeah, you, you kind of... Every once in a while, you get some good stuff. But I think it might be better once your foraging level's higher, potentially. I'm not sure, actually. All right, let's go check the quarry real quick. If the quarry's done, we're, we're, we're going to be golden today. screenshot. I was like looking for it and I was panicking and couldn't find the screenshot button. We got it. We got it. We got our 10 million. We did it. We did it, everybody. We got our 10 million right now. Any tips for the community center? What year one without fruit cape? Without fruit cape? Oof. I mean, you could try and try and get animals. Um. Um. Yeah, that's kind of the only other play you have there, really. Is just like do it with. Uh, do it with uh, like just basically focus on making enough money to get your barn to get the barn upgraded. You know, and get a coop and get the coop upgraded to get your, you know, your goat for your goat's milk and your cow for your cow's milk and your sheep for the wool and whatever. Then we'll start on the other side. Oh, crap, you're right. <laughs> that's a good point, yeah, that's, that's a good point. Um, we have to get a pom- oh, and a pomegranate tree. Yeah, you need that. Um, yeah, not without fruit cave, yeah. You also have to get lucky with um, the traveling cart and get either either get a red cabbage or get a red cabbage seed. Um, and you're also, if you want to get the community center, community center done quickly, well, actually, if you if you want to get it done in one year, then yeah, that, the big thing is the red cabbage. If you want to get it done by fall, then what you have to do is you have to get to the, you have to have enough money to get to the desert as well, and you can trade at the desert trader, trade some spring seeds to get winter seeds. And then you can grow winter seeds in the greenhouse, which by that time you'll have. Um, and then uh, you can get... Uh, you can get everything you need right there. That's not at all where I wanted to go. I wanted to go to the bus stop. Alright, so we'll do these... Oh my goodness, we did it. believe <laughs> we did it. Could I put the pomegranate tree in the greenhouse? Oh, absolutely, yeah. Absolutely. I would actually recommend it. If you have the greenhouse, I'd recommend putting it in the greenhouse. Just to make sure that you don't have to worry about uh, being out of season or whatever. Get it growing right away. I will actually... It depends when you... If you get it early enough, yes. If you get it early enough, then yeah, throw it in the greenhouse, because why not? Um, if you... Don't get it in time... Um, why I went that way, but anyways. If you don't get it in time, like, if, if the first pomegranate harvest won't be until fall anyways, I think it's a fall fruit, then, I mean, it doesn't really matter where you plant it. Like, I had, uh, um, 
I think I had like an apple tree and I had a... My pomegranate tree, actually, where they were both outside because I didn't buy them in time to get any fruit before fall anyways, so it's like... I bought them early and just planted them outside, and then that was it, basically. Then as soon as first day of fall, then I had it, right? So it wasn't that big a deal for those. And the apple tree, by the way. You'll need because you need three apples for the community center as well. So you'll need if you're not doing it, if you're doing it without the fruit cave, you will also need an apple tree, which also harvests in fall. But yeah, you can't get the greenhouse until fall anyway, so because you need the fall crops. So yeah. Uh, I guess I probably get it winter sometime if I really push. It. Oh, absolutely, yeah, it's totally doable. Ooh, mercy. Oh, and we have <gasps> and we have gold quality. Oh my word. And we have gold quality. Gold quality casks. These casks were only <coughs> excuse me, we're only gonna get to gold anyways. Except I can't see behind the uh, keg, so let's just get these replanted. Yeah, these 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 uh, these casts were only going to get to gold quality by the end of the year anyway, so I'm just going to cash them out right now. We're going to go to Pierre and just take all of his cash. Keep missing kegs. There we go. That's another one. So much easier when you're in a spot where the screen can scroll with you and you can just hold your mouse in one spot. Have the game take care of everything. Just one there. Triple shot just ran out. 1.20 p.m. I do want to make sure we get to Pierre today. Because if we can get to Pierre today, then what I might do is go see the wizard. golden clock today. Oh my goodness, we did it. I'm so happy. Oh, we did it. We did this thing. How exciting. I did talk to Maru today, right? Can't talk to her. I guess I did. We watched the TV today, we did the bruschetta. And I've got some casks that I can put into here to get some hardwood. All right, let's go see Pierre and clean him out. Let's go see if he's got some cash on hand. I'm so happy I'm even gonna grab these guys. Hey, a winter root. Well, I mean, we cut it close. We definitely cut it close. It's 21st of winter at the end of year two, but we're about to clear two million. Oh my word. Oh. I can buy the return scepter now. <laughs> that is, that's funny. That is humorous to me. Um, have you ever used the guarantee year one completion option? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's I basically just used that to make sure that um, I would get the red cabbage from the traveling cart. Well, since I have the extra million, I'm gonna spend 12 million today. What up, Krovis? Give me that return scepter, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Pierre Rich, not no mo. Okay, the other thing I need to do, actually, because again, today's the last day I can put any star fruit in. I shouldn't have sold that star fruit, because there might be more kegs that pop yet today. I'm probably going to go to bed. Um, but yeah, so anything, any kegs that finish now, we can put in um, pumpkins. Basically, there's no point now in putting in, I, well, I can't put in any more star fruit, because it won't be done in time. So now it's all pumpkins. Finished recipes. I got one recipe left. I made bruschetta today. I need to get shrimp cocktail, but that's not available until the very last day. So. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> oh. Ugh. 
is nice. And we got the Return Scepter. Oh. Uh, I just, I can't even tell you. Cannot even express in my mere... Crap, I shouldn't have stolen the Starfruit. I sold it to Pierre, too. Crap, that was a mistake. Because now I can just put pumpkins in these kegs. <sighs> so good. Your Pierre supplier, he offered you wholesale. Now he's heading out to the other town to sell at retail. I know, right? Alright, so I'm probably not going to bother making any more triple shot. Um, finesse people to buy the Starfruit wine. It's funny, because whenever you do that... Um, So you always talk to somebody in town, they're like, oh, I bought a star for one from Pierre. It tasted terrible. I don't know where he got it from. Oh, man. I mean, that's it. We're, we're, we're done. We did the challenge. We did it. Um, I literally need to do nothing else except to get that last recipe. I don't, even know to, I don't even know what to tell you. Don't even know what to tell you. Let's talk to Maru. That's very important. Um, I mean, yeah, there are no kegs that are ready at this point, so sleep, sleep it off, I guess. Sometimes they will say it was good. Oh, will they? Oh, okay. Um, think, 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 think. Is there anything else I want to do? No. <laughs> Almost enough for Pam's house. I know, right? Maybe my next bat. I mean, some star fruit will finish here soon, I'm sure. Um, so maybe when that, when that's done, then I'll do Pam's house, just because... There we go, we got a little bit done right now. Oh, such a load off the mind. Holy cow. Oh, I should be uh, eating them crab cakes, though. There we go. This 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 will definitely be enough for... This will get me everything I need to make to do Pam's house. I'm gonna end the year broke. Guess what, Maru? Congratulations, you married me. Uh, but I blew every cent on a clock and uh, a return scepter. Are you doing another challenge? You know, I don't know. Probably not anytime soon. <laughs> I'm going to take a bit of a break. There's some other stuff I want to do. Uh, speaking of which, let me should talk about this here, actually. Um, so let's talk about the next few days on stream. So, obviously, this challenge is going to be over su successfully, amazingly. Um... I feel like, am I forgetting something else here? 19 guys to go, Knut. Oh, the starfruit's done. Yeah, starfruit's done today. I gotta go back to Ginger Island. Um, so yes, tomorrow on stream, tomorrow's Monday, tomorrow, very special stream. Um, tomorrow I'm gonna be playing Krunker once again. What am I doing? To sell this stuff directly to Pierre. Um, tomorrow I'm gonna be playing Krunker on stream. I haven't played Krunker in a long time. I'm gonna, get, get, gonna be getting together with It's Belgian Waffle, with um, some other folks. We're gonna we're gonna play Krunker. It's gonna be h hilarity will ensue. Um, what else? Then Tuesday. Um, wait, are we playing on Tuesday? Hold on, can't remember. Let me double check. I'm sure about telling tales out of school here. Uh. So tomorrow, I'm not playing Krunker. Tuesday, we're playing Krunker. On Tuesday the 24th, we're going to be playing Krunker with its Belgian Waffle and some other folks. So tune in for that. Um, on tomorrow, so does Pierre buy for more than you sell a crate? No, I sell it to Pierre directly because it's just you get the money right away instead of having to wait for wait for overnight. That's the, that's the, that's the only reason. The Return Scepter teleports you right back to your front door from wherever you use it. So it's it's cost two million gold, but if you're but if you're not you know in, trying to do a challenge run or you're not worried about the money, totally worth it. It's like a a, a warp totem. It's like a farm warp, to warp totem, instead of, but instead of warping you just to the thingy on your farm, it warps you right to your front door, which is awesome. I will actually show that to you momentarily. Um, anyway, so tomorrow what I'm going to do on stream something I've been talking about doing for a while. I'm going to play through all three Hitman games on tomorrow's stream. So I'm basically going to do the I can't believe it's not a speedrun because I'm not a speedrunner. But uh, that's my plan for tomorrow is to play through all three Hitman games. 
Um, I have, you know, decently fast ways of doing all the levels, so I should be able to play through all three. Which is hilarious thinking about it because, you know, when I first got the games and played them on stream, it would take me... I'd be lucky to get through a level in, a, like, in an hour. And now I'm hoping to get through all three games in... Um, I'm thinking maybe two and a half or so, potentially, give or take. We'll have to see. Um, so that's the plan for tomorrow. Then Tuesday, we got Crunker. How did you work with Ginger Island? I have the uh, totem for Ginger Island. I have the the obelisk, rather. I have the obelisk for Ginger Island, which you have to get to complete perfection. So yeah, I've got that. Um, I can't believe it's not food. Um, so yeah, Tuesday. So tomorrow's Hitman. Tuesday is Crunker. Um, then Wednesday, I have no idea what I'm doing. I don't know if I'm going to do a music stream on Wednesday again. I'm going to start doing some music streams again. I'm not sure if it'll be a music stream or if I'll do something else. Um, at some point I'd like to play some Mini Metro as well. I might do that. I might do a bit of Mini Metro on Wednesday. But, uh, maybe I'll make Wednesday, like, just random game day. Or I'll play some Mini Metro. Maybe play some Flight Gear or something as well. Do some Flight Sim stuff. We'll see. I don't know. Pickleball. Could do pickleball. Could do that. I wish I had a way to stream pickleball. That would be kind of fun. But um, well, I shouldn't say that. I would have a way to stream it, but I wouldn't have a good way to keep to keep track of chat. That's the problem. Because I'm out run, running around on the pickleball court. How do I keep track of like who's saying what without having somebody on the sideline yelling to me every time someone types something in the chat? But yeah, so that's the plan for the rest of the week. Uh, tomorrow's Hitman. Um, Tuesday is Crunker. Wednesday, God knows what. Just become pro. Just become pro, have somebody do it for me. I could do that. I could do that. Yeah, I don't think you understand how bad I am at pickleball. I don't think you quite... Uh, I am not good. I have fun, though. We were out um, playing with some folks <clears throat> um, yesterday. Actually, one of the first people that Diane and I met playing pickleball, super, super nice guy. We were playing with him and his wife. And... Uh, yeah, just, like, really fantastic. Super nice people. And, um, but yeah, it kind of reminded me just how bad I am. Because normally Diane and I just kind of play against each other. And when we're just playing one-on-one, -on -one, I don't play to win. I play to, like, practice and to rally and to... But play, play to rally, basically. Like, I'm not trying to, like, destroy her. I'm just trying to, like, practice my shot control and whatever else. And uh, when you when we're playing when we're playing doubles with other people, you kind of... And you really have to, like, play a proper game. It kind of really r reminds you of how good or how bad you are. Some streamers use text to voice in chat. That is true. That is true. I guess if I was wearing like headphones or something, I could do that. But it's kind of it would. Be, the thing about that, it would have to be a thing where the people I was playing with would have to know what was going on. Like if I was just playing with. Excuse me. If I was just playing with random people, I'd be like, who are you talking to? And Oops, what's going on? And why are you doing this? Um, um, but yeah, if I was playing with people who, like, knew, okay, yeah, Paul's streaming, and this is, you know, with what's going on with it, stuff out would be a little bit different. But maybe one day. Or maybe one day I'll do, like, a... I'll film a game or something like that, and then... I'll just play I'll, I'll play the game as, as the stream. Instead of playing a video game, I'll just play the... Pickleball footage or something. I don't know. We'll see. I have been enjoying it, though. Pickleball is a lot of fun. My knees thank me. <laughs> it's a lot easier on the knees than basketball, I'll tell you that. Well, this is the last of the star fruit. This is the thing. I don't need, like, I don't even need to do the greenhouse or anything anymore. Like, I may as well just leave everything in the greenhouse. Just let it sit. Don't need it. I'm not trying to make as much as possible. I've made my money. I've got everything. I'm literally just... The only thing I need for perfection now is that shrimp cocktail recipe. If I screw that up, it's going to be a big ripperino. Alright, so we'll go... We'll head back to the two... Uh, sort of out, and we'll go and see Pierre. We'll sell all the stuff. We'll cash out again. It's like as soon as I moved to the valley, Pierre knew he needed to have, he needed to have a lot of cash on him. All right, so Return Scepter, if you want to know what it does, it does this. So from there, bam, front door. All right, so let's go to... Right, we'll go to Pierre's, we'll sell the starfruit, sell the wine, sell whatever else. 
and um, they'll go see Robin, uh, and we'll upgrade. I think they just might do the upgrade, right? That's cool. Yeah, the return scepter is sweet. Return scepter is real sweet. All right, so there's two hundred thousand. There's a hundred thousand. There's two hundred thousand. There's a hundred thousand. We're up to a million. There's some bananas. There's fifty-four gold in uh, in that. In which we call it? Okay, let's go see Robin. It's probably a faster way to get to Robin, but actually there is a faster way to get to Robin. Let's take the return scepter and take the mountain totem. The, th the only thing about this is I'm not sure if we'll get the cutscene with Pam. I'm not sure if we're going to get that or not. She's not here. Oh, wait, but I can still shop, though, right? You can still buy something. It's on the honor system. Not what I had in mind, uh, but thanks for the help. All right, never mind. Okay, forget it. Pam doesn't get her house. Deep dab. Hello? There we go. All right. Oops, not bad. Okay, well, I mean, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages. Let's, let's, let's get this shrimp cocktail. Here's what we're going to do. I'm just going to ignore everything now. I don't even care anymore. Well, I mean, I don't know. I guess I'll grab it. Old habits die hard. I can sell this off on the last day, though, so I'm not too worried about it. Um, okay, so... I oh, what the heck. Let's, let's, let's really... <laughs> I can't help. I can't help it. I can't help it. I cannot help it. Alright, so we talked to my wife. I'm just going to double check this just to make sure. Okay. Screenshot. Ooh. What the heck? Triple shot. I think today might be the last day to put stuff in the kegs anyways, actually. Now that I think about it, because we got four days left, so yeah. I think today is officially the last day we're putting anything in these kegs. So that means I can actually sell everything else now. Now that I think about it. So, check the mail. Hey, 500 gold, nice. Festival of the Winter Star, don't care. Sell the pumpkins, sell the star fruit wine, sell the bomb, sell the wood, sell the stone, sell the coffee, why not? What the heck, I don't know. Start lobbing stuff. All right, here we go, people. We are wrapping this up. Another 400,000. We are super close. Say hi to uh, Maru. Still keeping the apricot stash? I guess I could probably sell that too. I really don't need to keep that anymore. Got some more. Let's drink another one of these. Ugh, so happy we made it. I'm so happy we made it. I was real worried there for... Well, I mean, to be honest with you, if I hadn't done the, the keg grind, I would, would not have made it. There's no way. Like, I had to go kind of crazy with the kegs. When's the last recipe? On the 28th. Like, it's on the very last day. So you literally... You, can, you literally cannot complete perfection in less than two years. Not in the standard game. Um, you just... You cannot. Alright, I can start selling stuff out of this chest now. So, diamonds, that. May as well sell the bombs. Uh... Bars and ore can all go. This is killing me on the inside to sell all this stuff, but... And staircases, I don't. I think I could sell, maybe? Although I think it's probably worth it to not sell that. It might actually be worth it to get the stone back from the staircases, if I'm not mistaken. Can't remember, but whatever, who cares? Uh, Alright, let's start selling all of the things. I'm actually kind of curious to know... Um, Um, yeah, I can't sell the staircases anyways. Kind of curious to know how much I will get in the end anyways. Like, kind of curious to find out. Does your spell's relationship decay once you reach 40 hearts? Oh, yeah. 
have to talk every day or else you lose 20 friendship points. Like, that's a huge amount. So you gotta make sure you talk every day. Hey, you got our first pumpkin wine. Nice. Uh, where's Mar? Is she over here? No, she must be outside. Oop, nope, not what I want. All right, two days. Two days to go. Yeah, I'm kind of curious to know how... Because, like, right now I'm, what, 1.8 mil? <laughs> so, really, I was, like... My estimates were good. I was... I, I try to, you know, estimate conservatively. So, my estimates were good. Um... A lot of friendship? Yeah. Yeah. Considering that you... Like, on with most people, you only decay two friendship points a day. Um... To decay that many is, like, a lot. Look at all the stone. Dang. Alright, start selling all the stuff. Great. Grab some of this stuff. I might just go harvest the greenhouse, I guess. There's probably some starfruit in there I can grab. Friend, the friendship is real. I guess I grab some of that stuff too. I might just wait. Let it finish up here. Oh yeah, we got a little bit. Does the hug and kiss uh, lose friendship if you don't do that? I don't actually know. I'm doing it just to be safe. I'm not actually sure. I know you need to talk to your spouse. I don't know if you need to officially interact with them or not. But, uh, what else? So I probably didn't need to plant that last round of starfruit. The last big round. Because that's probably not going to be done in two days. I mean, it might yet, but I don't know. We'll see. Anything in here I can sell? Those. <laughs> Six starfruit seeds. All right, we'll, we'll, you know what, well, let's gather these guys today, too. Why not? It takes seven days for them to refill, so, I mean, this is going to be the last. The last batch of oak resin. Thank you, oak resin farm. You served me well. These guys down here are probably done as well. Yes, they are. Yeah, the hug and the kiss I just kind of do because, I mean, right, you're already there talking to her, so why not? Fortunately, you don't have to give gifts every day. That's nice. Um, uh, I'm just going to sell those. Alrighty. Two days. Here we go. Here we go. I will have to harvest all the starfruit wine and stuff. But there's another 200,000. Oh, man. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of bittersweet, because on one hand, I'm, I'm su super happy I made it. Super happy it all worked out. But at the same time, it's like, ooh, I didn't have to make that many kegs? Hmm. <laughs> Imagine Mario watching you sell everything. I know, right? Technically, I could put all these kegs in the deconstructor, too, but forget that. Okay, tomorrow, must watch the TV. Don't want to get to the last day of the challenge and screw it up, so gotta make sure we watch the TV tomorrow. Gotta make sure I keep drinking Triple Shot. Got more than enough. I have no idea when this stuff's gonna finish. Tomorrow, hopefully. There's Mara, keep talking. Put these guys, oops, in here. Grab that. Pop over here, sell the stone and the pumpkin juice and the diamonds and the pine tar and we're good. Oh, no, no we're not. Got a few things here we can grab. Technically don't need to, but whatever. So two million. So we may. So not only did we buy the return scepter, so we actually made fourteen million because I, again, I spent two million on the return scepter. So really, um, I didn't actually need to. I mean, I would be at like fourteen million right now. Tips to get wood for all the kegs and tappers. What I did, to be honest with you, 
is I, when I had the opportunity, um, the foraging thing, I did uh, took the Forester. Normally I would not take Forester. Normally I do the foraging buff that um, increases the quality of your forgeable items. But because I was trying to get wood, and you can always switch this as well for however much money it costs to switch it. But uh, if you go with Forester, that 25% more wood makes a huge difference. Um, um, so yeah, I definitely did that. You know what I'm going to do, actually? You know what? Just to celebrate, I'm going to give Maru a diamond. All right. But yeah, that made it, that made a pretty big difference for me. Um, it's just doing that. Oh, well, we did it, everybody. We got through it. Thanks to all the tips and tricks from, like, Blade and Piano Addict. And thanks to Wathman for <laughs> making sure I got all the stuff in my kegs. Um, yeah, we got through it all. Wow. Unbelievable. I mean, don't get me wrong. Um, I did set this up to be as easy as possible. The only reason I was panicking about this is because I completely wet the bed in the first year. Um, just completely screwed up the, how I did the first year. Um, and uh, did such a bad job in the first year that... Um, um, yeah, it ended up being, being a mild panic. But... Uh, did you have a tree area to put trees for wood at? Yeah, I used the train area for that. Um, I should have used the desert, actually. That would have been way better. Because then you get... Then trees will grow in the winter in the desert. Um, so the desert's good for that, for sure. Tree, tree, train area is good for that, as well. It's a nice big open area. Um, yeah. Between those two spots. That's, those are... You, you get enough trees planted, for sure. I did, I did buy some wood, too. Let me, let me be clear about that. I did not harvest all the wood for all these things. A lot of the wood got bought. Not a lot, but a good amount. Um, so that came down to doing, doing running the numbers and kind of saying, okay, well, if I buy this wood... Um, where's my food? Oh, I should sell the food, too, actually. So let's eat a crab cake. So, oops, that's not a crab cake. I came down to doing the math and saying, okay, how much am I going to spend on this? And then, um... Um, is it worth spending the money on it, right? So... Hey, energy, energy tonic. Thanks, Pam. Alright. Uh, how did you mess up the first year? I just tried to do too much all at once. Um, I just spread myself way too thin. I was trying to do too much. So, like, in the first year, I should have focused on either French... Well, well, if I were to do this challenge again, what I would do is... In the first year, I would just focus on making money. I would focus on, like, getting... You know, making the money in the first year, so that way I can buy the golden clock and get everything else. Um, and then the second year... The second year would go way better, because I'd have all the obelisks and have, you know, the golden clock and whatever else. Um... So I would have done that differently for sure. Um, um, let's see here. Did you watch TV? You just saved my run. You li you literally just saved my run. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> you just saved the entire stinking run. But for the first time in my career, thanks to DevMJ123, I'm going to hit this checkbox right here. And now my perfection tracker is empty. What I should probably do is change this so that if there are no items available, it says you're done or something like that. Um, this is really not looking very good, but we did finish. We got perfection. Payback for all the tips. Hey, if, 
That was helping me more than it helped you, let me tell you. Oh, okay. Well, thank you for saving my run. Let's head up to the quarry. Uh, may as well take the train. Or the, that'd be faster to take the uh, minecart, actually. Head up to the quarry. So we've got two million. We're going to make a good chunk of change today, actually. Um, what up, Pam? Grab those mixed seeds. They sell for, like, one or none or something. Wow. What a thing. Unbelievable. I mean, I mean, yeah, okay, I made it as easy, as easy as possible. I freely admit that. You know, I made sure I could complete the community center super early. I made sure that, uh... Oh, yeah, I meant to start the other side. Oh, it doesn't matter. I got the uh, return scepter now. Um, I made sure I could finish the community center super early, and I made sure that, you know, so I can get to Ginger Island and get that stuff going, and... Um, I used the forest farm so that I could have easier access to forageables and hardwood. Um, I married Maru because she's super easy to gift. You can just give her gold bars or diamonds or whatever from crystallariums. Wrong side again. Yeah, I was thinking about that, but I, I got the return scepter now, so I don't care. Um, but yeah, like we... It still did it. So I'll take it. I can say I've completed perfection in two years. We did it, yeah, we made it, we got, we got it done. Wow. With, with, with actually an embarrassingly loud amount of money to spare. It's actually kind of, you know, well, actually, well, you know what this shows though, honestly? It shows the perfection in two years, really not that bad. Like if you really, in the first year, if you're really focused on who's the hardest spouse to, hardest spouse to gift for, um, probably, who's the hardest spouse to gift for? That's a good question, I'm not sure. You can buy Pammer House. I could buy Pammer House. Whatever. I'm done. Alex? Oh, Alex, yeah. Boop. And I'm done with the crab cakes. <sighs> we did it. Freaking did it. Just to confirm. Just to confirm. Let's go see... Uh, Let's go see Mr. Chi. Grab the nanners. We're gonna go have a look at the in-game perfection computer and make sure it's not screwing me here. Triple shot just ran out. We got it. We got it, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Summit cutscene? Yes, we will make sure we relish does this change at all? No, it doesn't change. Okay, we we will relish the uh, the cutscene. Oh, I don't even care at this point. Grab this stuff. Oh, I don't even care. Let's just sell a couple things. Beautiful. Congratulations. Thanks very much. Thank you, Dev, for saving my run. Okay. Bang. So let's see how much money we made today. We made another two mil. So really, I needed to get 10 to 10 million. I actually got 16. <laughs> so we uh, we got it. You feel it in your heart. Somewhere, somehow, Grandpa is beaming with pride. The legacy of Cowbell Farm is eternal. My dear boy, it's been many years since we last... A rumbling sound heard in the distance. Okay, lots of stuff going on. Uh, it's been many years since we last spoke. You were just a little boy. Do you remember? Look how far you've come. Though you may have forgotten me, I've been here all along. Creepy. You see, my body has departed this world, but my heart will always remain in Stardew Valley. Isn't your heart a part of your body? Like, isn't it? You've been here two years now. I'm so proud of you, my boy. You're a better farmer than I ever was, and you've brought great honor to the family name. You kind of get paid, Grandpa. I can, fe I can feel it now. My spirit is finally put to rest. Bless you. The future of Cowbell Farm is in your hands now. Farewell. Now I'm done with Cowbell Farm, baby. I'm, I'm starting a new farm next time. Let's go sit talk to Maru. Ugh. We did it. Parrots are there. Oh, yeah, that's right. We got the Statue of Perfection or whatever. Concerned Date Mask of the Volcano was available too. Concerned Date. Oh, really? Hmm. Winter caught up with Santa. What's in the mail right now? 
chocolate cake. Thanks, Evelyn. All right, I wish I hadn't sold um, all the crab cakes, because this is going to take me a while to get to where I need to go. But let's go enjoy... can't remember where I was going. Let's go enjoy the cutscene. Let's go do this. Let's do this, you guys. Thank you to everybody who stopped in tonight for the, for the final episode. Thank you for sticking with me for, through 57 episodes. Or 56 or 57. We talked about that earlier. It was a lot of episodes either way. Let's go get this cutscene. How did Maru beat me up here? That's my question. Hey, Paul. Hey, Maru. And who put the bench up here? Like, how long has that bench been there? Great view, huh? Yep. I was just thinking about the last three years. We've been through a lot together, haven't we? Well, I mean, we. But look how far we've come. I know we're rich. You've really accomplished a lot since you moved here, Paul. It's incredible. Worked more than you, better shape. I think it's safe to say that you were meant to be a farmer. Does each spell say something different? I don't know. They might. I'm not sure. She didn't realize we had perfection in two. <laughs> There's a crow carrying a Krobus. Shout out to Bowser from Super Mario World. There's the wizard on a magic carpet. There's the witch. I wonder if the wizard and the witch ever get back together. There are the fairies. Help you grow your crops. There's some UFOs, because why not? What just happened? I didn't hit anything. Was I supposed to click something there? Oh, it said we'll skip. Oh well. Anyway. Here's Alex's dog. There's not gonna lie. I'd marry Sandy. Oh, there's the raccoon thing. Where the heck that thing is. The hat hallucination. Never had a blue chicken. Or a golden chicken. But I don't think you get a golden chicken until after you get perfection anyways. Oh, there's uh, there's Bingo. Did you skip the cutscene? I didn't hit anything, so I'm not sure what happened there. Hopefully I didn't. Was there anything after that cutscene? I don't know. Does anybody know if there's anything after that? when that concerned date thing, plane was flying by. I didn't hit anything, it just kind of went boop and moved me, so it like, skipped the rest of the scene, so I don't know what's going on there. There's the mermaids. Ugh, all the fish. Ugh. I'm telling you. If I do this again, absolutely doing money in the first year. Basically treating year one like a money run, and then year two you can do the friendship, the recipes, whatever. Uh, because the cutscene's real. Uh, I remember the UFO, that's about it. Okay, hopefully I didn't miss anything. There's some slimes. Oh, that's the mermaid from uh, Ginger Island, I think. Unless, they're, unless there's also a mermaid that waves at the winter fest winter whatever it's called winter festival thing. All the monsters. <laughs> Had some bones flying through the air. There. Ugh, eyes bugging me. Got the skellies. Man, this whole soundtrack slaps though. I do rather enjoy the soundtrack.
Those Dwarver Sentries, though. Not a fan. Putrid Ghosts are worse, never mind. Putrid Ghosts is probably my least favorite. The Magma Sparklers were kind of annoying, too, or Sparklers were kind of annoying, too, but the fact that the Putrid Ghosts make you so you can't eat is not a good time. And thanks for the tip, whoever gave me that tip, or I think you said that I could just drink drink something and it gets rid of the effect. Good tip. Okay, now we need to discuss this. I have seen this this before. Um, we have some questions we need to answer. We'll discuss that in a second. It's been a long road. Plain ginger works too. Oh, really? Huh, good to know. You challenged yourself to reach the summit. Yes, I did. What an accomplishment. Yes, it is. We, okay. We've been watching every step of the way. Remember that. Keep that in mind. And you've made us and you've made us very proud. They're both saying this together collectively. Okay. We're going to talk about this here in a second. There we go. The summit. I kind of wish there was a bit more up here. I could it's too bad there isn't more up here, but... I guess you can still access your inventory. Alright, we're back at the house. Okay, well... We, ladies and gentlemen, have officially accomplished perfection in two years, but can we talk about that last cutscene for a second? Can we just talk about that for a second? So... Grandpa, who is a spirit, and Mr. Chi, who is a weirdo, are saying, yeah, we've both been watching and we're both so proud. That raises more questions than it answers. Like, what this whole time, what relationship do Grandpa and Mr. Chi have? Like, how are they associated? And how, like, what's going on with that? May as well grab that. Um, you know what I mean? Like, if they've been watching the whole time, so Mr. Chi knows about Grandpa and Grandpa knows about Mr. Chi and they're both collectively like, why are they so proud? How do they know each other? Why did nobody tell me this ahead of time? What the hell? Anyways, um, that is it for the Stardew Perfection in Two Year Challenge. I'm gonna wrap up the video for YouTube. If you're watching this on YouTube, thanks very much. Um, thanks for getting through. This was a particularly long video as well, so thank you very much for watching. Um, yeah, very well to YouTube. Hope to see you all one day on Twitch. Until then, farewell.